three, two, one. It's the pig. It's the boar. Do you remember this? This was in the Goosebumps game. This was like a random jump scare in the Goosebumps game. It's just as scary as like pig J JPEG. <laughs> it's, it literally scared the hell out of me because I was like, duh, what the hell's that? I forgot I changed it. I only have Wi-Fi squidget wish for a bit. Yeah. Oh, I love that. I love doing bits on stream and then just like having a bunch of random images like lost in the scene collection and you're like, why did I add these? What was I talking about when this happened? Why is there EGAD's like little tiny butt cheeks in my stream? Yes, there is a canonical, there is a canonical uh, EGAD ass shot in a Luigi man, in a Luigi manga. I'm not sure which one, but yeah, his ass is straight out. Anyway, do you want to play Ice Spy Spooky Mansion? The answer is, of course, yes. We're playing Ice Spy Spooky Mansion right freaking now. Yippee! I'm so glad. I've played this game last year, but I'm doing it again this year because screw it, it's a great game. Black Hammer Productions. Pick from the list. This is what. Type in your name. Then click on the spider to enter the game. Yippee! Or, to return to a game that is already done, pick your name with the star. It shows that you've won. Oh, did I not win? I'm pretty sure I won. Whatever. Let's go again. Oh, <gasps> Ice Bay Boogie Mansion! I love this game. I love that it adds, like, your name in so many places. Ooh, I love this game. A winner is you, <laughs> Scooby Doo! <laughs> Enter if you dare. Okay, what the fuck is this resolution game? <laughs> I'm sorry, game. Could you not make it a little bit bigger? I'm gonna have to crop this. I, I thought that resizing the screen would help. Apparently not. <laughs> okay, let me just fix that real quick. Yeah, this game is this game is not a Windows XP game. This is a Windows 98 game, which means that it runs at teeny tiny baby resolution, <laughs> even teenier and tinier than Windows XP itself. So I gotta like let me do that'll do crop it. Whoa, there we go. Look at that beautiful blown up JPEG quality. Yeah, let me in. in for a scare. Guys, I'm scared. Gulp. <laughs> You've entered the house. Now the fun can begin. <gasps> Too bad you can't get out the way you came in. <laughs> oh no. There's another way out. Here is a clue. Behind the picture frame is a puzzle for you. Okay, spread your butt cheeks. <laughs> what if he was just like, welcome to my spooky house. You better be quiet as a mouse. Uh, If you exercise, you'll be swole. Now show me your butthole. That's the puzzle. Damn, this is a freaky ass This skeleton. puzzle is a secret message which tells you how yeah, to Yeah, 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 yeah. We got the, the fucking plan. But the pieces are I can't even skip the dialogue. Help. To earn puzzle pieces, <laughs> you have to go solve the I Spy riddles that I've hidden in this house. Yeah, I get it. Then, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come back here and put your pieces in place. Yeah, 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 yeah. I've played this game before. I know what I'm doing. Let's, let's, uh, let's go. Let's, let's make some freaking progress. Let's just, I just want to try and beat this game in like an hour or so that we can, so we can play the other game too. Mystery bins. Mystery Watch for bin. the hint and figure out how these objects match. Wait, I'm then, confused. Empty the bins by clicking on the matching pairs. Okay. Be careful. Go. Here's your hint. It shall be at a button. That was not a hint. Uh, oh yeah. Bro, I'm so fucking smart. Bro, why is there like an F-35 jet? Oh, yippee! Here are some more Nordstrom objects, gum rick, whatever the fuck. Watch out. <laughs> this time, they match in a different way. Oh shit, guys. If you want, this is fucking you sick. Can go to another level this is wild. Any time. I'm so scared. The brown arrows. Okay, here's your hint. I forgot the skeleton boy yaps a lot. Bro, I'm so smart. Do I even need to do I even need to do this? I forget. Is this like a requirement? A new record. Wait, I don't think I need to do this. I don't think I need to do this. I don't think this is a requirement. Okay, bye. I need just to do some uh, some spooky guessing. Come on. I need your I need your help as well. Skeleton boy ASMR2. Stick it up your ass. I mean what? 
spooky, spooky butt jump scare. Here's a riddle for you to solve. Oh, here we Listen go. Listen to it, then hunt for the items the riddle asks for on this Out screen. Out Say hey, Harold, and what's up? Walk him in. Walk him in. Cone, howl, a space for a tooth. Okay, I made him shut up. That's fine. As as much as I love the little dialogue, at the same time, I have to wait for him to finish talking a bit much. But yes, welcome in, welcome in. Hi, I waved to you. Hi, I waved to you. I wave, I wave. Also, I forgot to say, um, an, an anonymous gifter last stream gifted 20 subs. So some people might have some gift subs, which is really freaking awesome. And I don't know who did it, and I'm mad because I want to wanna thank them. But they made it anonymous. Hmm. Hmm. It's so mad. But anyway. Everyone say thank you, Anonymous Gifter, if you got a gift sub. Teehee. Let me, let, okay, let's do this stuff. Um, a space for a tooth. Yippee. A space for a tooth. Thank you, but appreciative. Yeah, exactly. Hmm. They came up from Cass's raid, so I'm like, mm, who, which, which one of you was it? Somebody was being very nice. Okay, let's do this stuff. Pinecone, found it. A pinecone. I love the little jam. A howl? Where's the awu? Where's the awu? Where are you? Where's the wolf? Not the moon. A half moon? Where's the ho Oh, there's the howl. I found it. Yeah. Howl. A, fl a frog? A frog? A frog. Okay, where's the- okay, what are we looking for? A face with a grin. Nice. A face with a grin. A face in the sky. That's a, a face bam. Damn, his fucking lips. He's he's got some DSL. This is a spooky ghost face. An owl. An owl. A yowl. Uh a duck safety pin. There's a oh that is. It's really hard to see on this teeny tiny screen, but a I'll duck try hard. Pin. I'll try hard. Where's the wishbone? Oh, there's a paperclip. Wait, was do we not need the paperclip? Okay, I guess we don't. Half moon. Just the half moon, not the whole one? Bro, I didn't see the whole one. We just so we need a fly, a wishbone, a half moon. Where's the fly? Is it in the Venus flytrap? No. Uh guys, I'm screwed. <laughs> guys, I don't know what I'm doing. I'm scared. We don't need the oh, we don't need the bat. I can see the bat. Mmm. Oh, there's the wishbone. Got it. I forget you have to be so a wishbone. <laughs> you, you have to be so careful with the uh high school god damn it. You have to be so careful with the clicking. Uh half moon. Oh there it is. Ha <laughs> ha. A half moon. This game genuinely gets harder as you get older because your eyes get worse. I just realized that. This game starts easy and then when you're old you're like, eh, what the heck? Jimmy, son Jimmy, help me out with this video game. Grandma's can't see like she used to. It was also easier when this was blown up on a big ass screen rather than rendering it at teeny tiny res, but hey. I'm not sure if I can, uh... I'm not sure if I can, uh, increase the size anyway. Yeah, I'm not sure if I can increase the size without, like, screwing everything up. I've learned my lesson, which is don't resize the window when you're emulating uh, a PC, because in the real world, monitors don't change resolution randomly. They're pretty fixed. So if you change the resolution of an emulation, it's like, God, what the hell did you just do? And it starts freaking out. So don't do that. Where the fuck is the fly? Oh, it's in the Venus flytrap name. Wait, is it? No, it's not. <gasps> I lied. I'm wrong. I'm sorry. Cancel me on Twitter. Wait, don't cancel me on Twitter. Cancel me on Blue Sky. Who's the first person to write a uh, twit longer on Blue Sky? Come on. Found it. Yeah. A fly. Yippee. Congratulations, kid. One out of twenty. You want a puzzle piece to put in the frame. Look by the Did front door it? where you no. enter the game. I spy Venus. Oh god, are we gonna do it again? A dog, a Venus. 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 I'm your Venus. Still just chatting. Oh, thank you. A dog. Thank you for telling me, so I could change it to I Spice Boogie Mansion. I Spice Booba. Is I Spice Boogie Mansion even a category? I... How do you... Sp okay, is it is it all one word? I Spy... Spooky Mansion. Zero followers! What the fuck? No one follows this game? I refuse to believe that. 
Everyone follows the remake. <laughs> nah, I mean, I, I'm, you, you'd be surprised. Pretty much every single game that's ever, ma ever made is on a Twitch category. The reason why people don't use them is because they either don't want to search for them or there's like no like discoverability so most people just like pick retro because it's like got more discoverability but i like being i like being uh as like i like being as accurate as i can be because i think it's really funny <laughs> when you scroll down on my twitch page it's like oh doran has been playing and it's just like the most random mix of shit <laughs> i really like seeing that i think it's really funny because then people will be like, oh, this guy is mad. This guy has actually lost his marbles. He's playing Goosebumps from 1998. <laughs> yes, please. You, especially because, like, if you're a, um, if you're a variety streamer, you don't really have a big game that takes up those slots. So it's just, like, random shit that you've just recently, recently been playing. I use that to, like, pick who I watch sometimes. Because I'm like, what are you known for playing? And if it's just, like random stuff i'm like yeah this is a good stream if it's like they're known for playing apex and apex and apex i'm like get out of here you play halo 2 as your category when streaming an mcc version of halo 2 that's fair that's fair do that sometimes it's like yeah if you see because like you know it on the like twitch like sidebar it, you, you can like see the game people are playing and honestly i feel like that's a better indication of whether you should be streaming or like tuning in than the title because the title gets cut off so much so just like yeah put some fun game or like yeah and also like halo 2 is better than master chief collection because then you're like well which one <laughs> you know also are you playing halo 2 with uh are you playing halo 2 with like the remastered graphics or original that's a real good question because i have a, i have a hot take about that i have a hot take about the uh the remade One graphics to where's the where's the second four um um, what the freak? Oh god, there's so many stars I gotta click. You prefer OG graphics based? Nice. One five pointed star. They are. <laughs> yeah, the original graphics Two are like. Five pointed stars. The new. The, the, so wait, the H2A, the Halo 2 anniversary new graphics are pretty good. Yeah, I mean, it, it's less about like how it looks, more about like. It's much harder to see stuff with the new graphics in terms of like guns on the ground and and you know grenades it's much harder to see them in the new graphics because there's so much grass in the way um and also just like the night the night scenes were like in the original graphics they just have a very beautiful like look to them and in the remake they like they look very clean everything looks like it's the middle of the day the sunsets don't look as sunny come out evolved anniversary graphics are the ones i have an issue with yeah honestly yeah that's the one i have the biggest issue with too that was the i when i played because i have never I never played Halo growing up, so <laughs> when I played it for the Three, first time, five pointed stars. when I played it for the first time, I played Halo 1 with original graphics, Halo 2, I think I played Halo 2 with original graphics too, um, although I did switch it for the new cutscenes, it was a bit weird. I, I like the remade cutscenes, I think they're really like beautiful looking, they're like cinematic as hell, so, but it's it's just a game, I switch it back. <laughs> a wide open mouth, yippee. A wide open mouth. 3, 4, 3, Guilty Spark. Yeah, everyone just looks strange. It's weird. A tree or a snail? A tree on a nail? Wait, hold up. Hold the phone. Tree on a nail? What the heck? There's a tree on the nail. I got it. A tree on a nail. And a snail. A snail. A snail. Where's the, f where's the other four? I'm like f freaking the fuck out. Three bats? Well, there's a bat. Get him. One bat. There's a second bat. Two bats. Yippee. Yippee. And they do, I love that they all do little dance. Three I love this. Bats. And where's the caterpillar? Um, where's the fucking caterpillar? Um, you're not a caterpillar. You're a stick inside. Um, caterpillar, please. Duck. Did I click the duck? Bike handlebars? God, I'm so like... I need to look at the other screen. It's bigger on that side. Oh, well, there's the bike handlebars. Okay. Bike handlebars. Vista build for Halo 2. You've been two streams of that drop streaming. Oh, no. It killed you. Drop streaming. No. The Halo curse. You have to stop playing Halo, bro. Stop playing Halo. You'll never escape. It's something about it. That being said, I was like... I was playing Dark Souls 1 and then I like stopped streaming for like two months. There are just certain games that just do that to you. It's mostly just like, I don't know, if it's like a stressful time, this particularly is a problem. 
kind of just like I don't want to stream because I'm playing a scary stressful game which is why I've like kind of made a decision to like not play stressful games that much on stream you know two fours Ah, oh, life it's fair though it's fair it's like a lot of it's like a big fucking commitment to be consistent and also like you should oh there's the caterpillar I found him wait no you're a millipede I lied <laughs> yeah oh there's the caterpillar I found him Bro, what, did, what was that gluck slock noise the caterpillar was making? Why was it going? <laughs> That's crazy. A green caterpillar. Let's hear this noise in high def, shall we? A green caterpillar. So I'm just making him go gluck gluck for the hell of it. <laughs> A green caterpillar. Yeah, that's fair. Honestly, just like do whatever you want. Stream whatever you want. That's it. Just like do what you want. You don't have to be consistent. Consistency is like I don't know. If you want to like quote unquote grow then be consistent but like pfft, do you want have fun with it you know be fun have fun and like i don't know especially if it feels like a uh, an obligation then it can add like as soon as it's an obligation there's an element of fun that gets removed because you can't like just do what you want um but like don't let that stop you just having fun you know do what you want fuck you or don't i've already clicked that three five pointed stars i've already clicked that one I'll click that one. What's the other goddamn star? It's around Three, here somewhere. Five pointed stars. That's a six pointed star. This guy fucked with me. Where's the, where's the fourth one? Oh, is it that? Oh, I found it. Four five pointed stars. You were 64 is already and haven't been live in a year. Yippee! Have I followed you? I'm sure I have, right? I haven't followed you. Oh, 61 followers. Yeah. This riddle Get his is ass. done. Here's puzzle piece two. You still have a lot more riddles to do. Man, fuck you, Skinny Man Jones. Now, now you have to stream at least one more time, life. Ha 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 ha. I'm forcing you to stream. Here's a riddle for oh, you Oh, fuck, to solve. more fucking bullshit. Listen to it, then hunt for the Bro, items. Bro, I am fucking. Listen to this shit. I'm gonna click on logs. A trunk. Is there a bone? Where's the bone? Where's the bone? There's a log. Uh, I found the duck. One duck. You gotta do it, life. You gotta reach affiliate at least so that we can all watch ads on your channel. And then when there's an ad playing, I can go, meow, <laughs> your chat. <laughs> there, see how you like it. Nah, actually, do what you want, though. I'm not gonna, like, say, definitely do it. You ads, yeah, I know. A bone. Liz, if I could turn them off fully, I would. If I could turn them off fully, I truly would. Two ducks. It is kind of shitty because it's like if you're a, if you're a big ass streamer, a candle flame. If you're a big ass streamer, you can make like several hundred dollars a month from ads. So like for them, it's like oh yeah, of course I'm running ads so I can survive and make a living. But for every streamer below that size, you make nothing off ads. And so I was like, well, why don't I just turn them off? And then Twitch is like, ah ah ah, can't do that because we want to make money. And I'm like, ah, oh, you son of a bitch. It's mean. It's 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 a real it's a, yeah it's a bit bit it's a bit shitty. But I get it. I get it. Twitch somehow doesn't make a profit, even though they literally do nothing. <laughs> I don't get it. All you do is host videos. Why is this so hard for you, Twitch? Why can you not make a profit off of that? Three ducks. You take 50% of, like, the biggest thing that people do, which is gift subs. You take 50% of that and you're still not making money? I don't get it. Yeah, that's Trunk. fair. I mean, it's up to you. Like, if, if you don't want to be affiliate, then you just you just don't accept the contract. You don't accept the devil's contract. The problem is, is like, you need you need to you need to accept the affiliate agreement to have uh like more emotes, and uh and Twitch channel points. So like, even those things, even Twitch channel points, which aren't like a money making thing, you need to be affiliate for it. Which is like, ugh, bleh, but whatever. Anyway, enough <laughs> enough like meta posting. An F in a frame. Just do what you want. Fuck you, I don't do what you tell me. Dangling spider. That's a great a fucking noise. Spider. I wonder if I, I actually looked in I Spy Spooky Mansion. I was like, can I extract these files? I can't extract the image files, but I can extract the audio files. So I can get all of the audio from this game and convert it. I don't know what I'd do with it, but it's, it's doable. Where's the matches? An eye? Well, there's the eye. An eye. An eye. There's a match. Bro, bro, don't set this place on fire, One please. Match. What's the second match, bro? What the heck? There's a broom. There's a owl. 
An old clipper ship. This was this must have like freaked kids out because I'm like, what the fuck is a clipper ship? Clippers, oh, I've shipped clipper myself. Ship? <laughs> clippers. God damn it. God fucking damn it. <laughs> this is such a terrible <laughs> Jesus. Clippers. Okay, where's the paper clip? Where is it? Make them weems. I could. I mm, actually no. I'm not going to say it. I'm saying it. I got a plan. I got a plan. I've got a. I've got a plan in the works. But I ain't saying it. I ain't saying it. It's gonna be a surprise. Um. And yeah, it's always just good to have like random assets that aren't getting. I'm gonna get you copyright claimed because who's gonna copyright claim the I Spy Spooky Mansion CD from 1998 sound effects? Nobody. Whereas if you use like game sound effects, that might be like ah ah ah. A paperclip. Mario owns that sound. Screw you. I spy. Piece number three. You're good at this game. Dang. See where it fits in the secret message frame. Okay, I get you. I spy two arrows. Okay, yeah. <laughs> One arrow. You know, there's like 50 I spy games as well. Everybody plays I spy spooky mansion, but there's like a lot of other I spy games that we could be playing. Like throughout the year. Uh, maybe we should. That being said, they're all the same, so I'm like, eh, I don't know. Would it be entertaining to see multiple Ice Spy games? That might fall. Well, it fell, bitch. Damn. Fresh wood. Put it in. Oh, that's cool. That's like a different, like, interaction. Fresh wood on the fire. Where's the bat? Um, I, I, I read your message and I thought it said Ice Spy Aguna, and I was like, huh? What? There's a man jerking off in the corner. It's like, okay. Damn, do we have to click on him? And it just makes us... It makes like a squirt noise when you click on him. And it's like, Aguna. Aguna, a moona, and an apple pie. And you're like, oh, what? I'll be honest, the reason I extracted these game files is because I wanted to replace the images with like stupid meme shit, but I don't think it's possible. <laughs> I don't think it's possible because even if I could decrypt it, I couldn't then re-encrypt it in a way that it would work, sadly. Um... There are, I always want to like mod or break every game I play on stream. If I have the ability to break it, I will. I just find fun in that. I find fun in ruining games. Wah <laughs> Where's the fucking bat? Where is he? Where are you, batty bastard? Where is he? I only see a scorpion and a bug and various other bugs and a snake and a spider. There's the bat. <laughs> it's right in the middle. A bat. I cracked open door. Oh. Um. Um, there's a four. The number four. Who's gonna make a claim on a sound effects the soundtrack of a game when both of the studios who developed it went under shortly after releasing it? Huh? Does that apply to is it, are you talking about I Spy? Did Scholastic Games go under or like whoever made this game? That sucks. Clearly we should have bought more copies. It's it's everyone's fault for pirating this game. Hmm. I own a legal copy, I think, somewhere from like 20 years ago that I don't have on my person right now, but I definitely owned it at one point. Or maybe it came out of a cereal box. Oh, the source of your alerts. Wait, what are your alerts? Where, where are they from? Where's the fucking car? Thank God this classic games is okay. Thank God. There's a mouse. I just want to click on the mouse. A nail on the wall. There it is. Beep. A nail in the wall. Tiny tank up your arsenal? Oh, I've never heard of that. Hi, George. Hi. I'm going to give you a shout out. How are you doing, Jules? How is your day going? How is your Thursday going? I'll give you a shout out. Jules is playing a really fun, like, horror game collection. Oh, I forgot the name of the whole collection. I'm doing it anyway. <laughs> I just like to do it. Oh, what was, what's the game series you're currently playing? It's really cute. I'm very... Anthology of the Killer. God, it's so bizarre. I feel like there are so many in-jokes. <laughs> I only get some of them, but they're really good. Oh, you finished it on Tuesday? Yeah. I was like, I was dropping in and out. But yeah, goodness. I, I gotta I gotta rewatch the VODs to like get the games I missed, but it, it looks so fun. I love it. I have like never heard of that game before, but it looks so cool. It made, yeah, it made so many references to like, I don't know, the new wave reference was really funny. I was like, oh, there's the new wave. There it is. It's like a tsunami. Oh, I love that. It's so cool. You're playing more like spooky games, right? You have like such a good selection of like 
I don't know, not, not necessarily kid games, but like quirky, funny, like Halloween-esque games. I think that's really awesome. Rather than just like doing conventional horror, you have like all of the like, the like quirky fun stuff. Ice Space Wookie Mansion is a classic. Yeah, we're gonna like play this quickly or try to uh, play this quickly. And then we're gonna play the, um, the FMV Frankenstein game starring Tim Curry. <laughs> there is an FMV Frankenstein game starring Tim Curry that I really wanna try. You can't play extra scary games? I get you. An R. I'm like, I can play them if they're old enough. Like I can play the original Silent Hill, but I wouldn't be playing like a modern horror, like uh, like Outlast or whatever. <laughs> yeah, I'm so happy. Did I tell you? Um, oh yeah, I think I told you in like in your stream chat when I when I like popped in. Um, that's the first arrow. One arrow. Uh, I love that. Like I was playing the Goosebumps FMV game from like 1998, and then all of a sudden there's like Jeff Goldblum out of nowhere. Jeff Goldblum the vampire. It's so cool. I love that. He just kind of came out of nowhere, and I was like, Oh, Jeff Goldblum from 1998. You think like Outlast would make you straight up crap your pants and cry? God, yeah, it is it is bad. It's just like, I don't know, jump scares as well. I don't know. Whoa, what the heck? A cracked open oh, door. He was in there all along. Okay. Everyone help. Oh, there's a second arrow. I found it. <laughs> Yippee. Two. Arrows. Okay, where's the E? I need the E. I'm like slowly going blind because I'm playing this on a teeny tiny screen. He was a vampire. It was wicked awesome. It was wicked awesome. Oh, there's the E. Found it. Haha, -ha, I found the E. An E. Everyone do a dance. <laughs> Yippee. <laughs> okay, give me that. Give me that. You solved thing. one more riddle. Give me, give me, give me. Here's puzzle piece four. It goes in the message frame <gasps> by the front door. Yeah, thank you. Thanks. But yeah, oh my god, the, the the Goosebumps FMV game is really um not it's really tricky if you don't have a walkthrough. If you have a walkthrough, you can beat it in like five minutes, but without a walkthrough, it's so difficult. I I didn't know what I was doing the entire game. It was bizarre. It was it was freaking boys This or. mystery drawer is locked, as you can see. Yeah. Solve the secret message to find the key. Okay. Okay. Uh, I think we're good then, right? We can just leave. I forget how many puzzle pieces there are. There's like fifty. <laughs> There's so many things in this game. But yeah, so I really want to get to the uh the Frankenstein FMV game. I've been trying to find more like old PC games that work, but so many of them don't work at all on like my uh my XP. Which is very sad. Here's a riddle for you. Okay. I'm so, uh, yeah. I, I'm sad because, like, there's a whole bunch of games that I wanted to play that you just try and boot them up and they go bleh and they throw up and they don't work. So we got, I gotta try and, like, find a way to play them. Uh, backwards number. Um, that one. Hand on the wall. A backwards number. Hand on the wall. Hand on the wall. Acorn. Hand on the wall. I spy a wime. Hand on the wall. Time for rhymes. Rhyme for times. Did you see it? Rhyme. The S. S plus. Nice. You just got amazing rank in Osu. <laughs> oh, God. Never trust Osu players. They are cracked in a different level. Oh, my God. I see a nut. Oh, I wanted the skeleton to say nut. An upside down one. Um, that one. An nice. upside down one. A hand to the sun. That one. Ding dong. A hand to the sun. Um, a hand on the wall. I'm like, I see my name. I see the cogs. I see the bell. I see the nail. I see the trumpet. One horn. Damn. Oh yeah, we were also talking earlier, uh, Jules. We were talking earlier about the Tim Curry's extended edition of Toxic Love from Fern Gully. I, it's, I'm obsessed with that song now. <laughs> I'm obsessed with it. I've been listening to it like multiple times a day. That's because of Tim Curry's, like, yeah. Oh, God, you didn't, you don't know. Ooh, okay. Okay, I gotta play it again. I gotta play it again. Um, so, obviously, you know Fern Gully. You love Fern Gully. I love Fern Gully, too. It's a bit of, like, a like a fever dream film, but I love it. Um, all the songs in that film are great. Um, I do like the Batty rap. I, I won't lie. I do think it's funny. I think, I think raps in, like, 90s animated films are usually terrible, except the Batty rap has Robin Williams and therefore works. But... Okay, so there. So obviously, the version of the the version of Toxic Love in the film is only like a minute and a half long. There is a full version, which is four and a half minutes long, 
that was never used in the film but is on the soundtrack. The soundtrack is now on Spotify, which means I've been listening to the soundtrack. Let me just fast forward to Toxic Love like a minute and a half in. So let's listen to this carefully. Listen to this carefully. <laughs> oh, Tim. Uh. Yo. Close. Tim, Tim, please. Yeah, so, yes, he says it in the Kidsville fucking soundtrack. Let's listen to that again. He rhymed horny with bore me, which is a bit of a stretch, Tim. That means, so which, which is even funnier because it's like he had to shoehorn in... <laughs> He had to shoehorn in his sexual words into this game, into this song. God. Yeah. Okay. This whole song is like, I think if you took this song and you put it in, um, oh, what the heck is it called? Um, the, oh God, I'm like, I'm drawing a blank. What is it? It's the, it's the, it's the movie that Tim Curry was famous for. Uh, uh, oh God, what is it? It's, uh, uh, but Rocky Horror, of course, Rocky Horror. Yeah, if you if you played this song in Rocky Horror, it would fit because of like you know it's the same sort of vibe. It's Tim being a dog. It's Tim being a horn dog. It's so good. Yeah, this okay. This song is now my favorite because of that. The slot rhyme. Okay, using a slot rhyme for horny makes sense because he's just like, oh, I'm getting so turned on by all of this smog and smoke. Makes me rock hard, baby. It's just like, Jesus, Tim. <laughs> yeah, okay, this is fucking great. Um, I kind of want to go buy a CD version of the soundtrack now because it's reasonably priced. And I want to have this as just like a relic. As like an artifact of like spiritual power. <laughs> just to have the, the Fern Gully soundtrack on CD. Yeah, anyway. <laughs> that's, so there was just me listening to that song, not knowing what was coming. And then just getting like jump scared by it. <laughs> it's so good. Oh my god. Anyway, I, I actually watched Fern Gully recently. It's like, I do love it. It's, it's bizarre. It's a little unusual, but all the songs go hard. The animation is like, yeah, it's a little, it's cheap. It only costs 20 million to make, which is like nothing for an animated film. Um, especially when you've got like Robin Williams and Tim Curry doing voices. You just think like, where do they find the money to animate the thing? Where do they get it? But it's nice. It's a cute film. Although I'm not, there's some weird ass love, there's a weird ass love triangle going on between the like fairy girl and the fairy boy and the cool hip Californian boy who's called Zach. Probably Zach Coolboy. That's his, probably his full name. A crack. My ass crack? Where is it? Where's my ass crack? It's gotta be in here somewhere. Surely. <gasps> the quack. A crack. Nice. I still don't know the hand on the wall. I'm like, oh, there it is. Aha. Bro, he's like, a hand on the wall. A skate. Uh, is that a skate? No, that's a high heel. That's a skate. Yippee. A skate. A rhyme for three. Um, me. Weep, yippee. Uh, time. Where's the three? I don't get it. I see kind of a lot of things about the movie, but I like some of the songs. The animation is nice. And I had a mad crush on the fairy girl. Kid. Oh, valid. Honestly, valid. <laughs> me. Where's me? Oh. No, I can click on my name and it's not it. Unless I see the words M-E somewhere. They're all key. A oh, key. oh, no, that's just the key. <laughs> God damn it. Um, yeah, honestly, like, what is it? What, what was it with, like, 80s and 90s animated films with just, like, there's just, like, they, they can be pretty, like, okay, like a 5 out of 10 film, but then there's just, like, a really, like, cute female character in it, and you're just like, oh, heart eyes. I'm pretty sure there's, like, every animated film, though. Specifically from that era, though. It's like, you can have a fun film about, oh, we had a bunch of mice going on a magical quest. Anyway, here's my, here's the like mouse bartender. And you're like, oh, there's the most beautiful mouse I've ever seen in my entire life. The animators know what they were doing. <laughs> God damn it. What is it with, yeah. I swear there's like a whole bunch of like animated films from that era that are just like fever dreams to me because 
I, like, they're not like Disney Renaissance. They're not Disney classics. They're just there. You know, Great Mouse Detective and Rescuers and stuff like that. Why there were so many mouse films from the 80s? What was going on there? Why were there so many mice? Found a bee. That, okay, so that's the, the rhyme, rhyme for three. <laughs> for a three. Radomatoes, yeah. What am I missing? Have I done it? Uh, oh, three horns. Need another horn. Okay. Yeah, I, I love the Great Mouse Detective. I love the Great uh, Great Mouse Detective. It's very, it's very. I feel like the '80s Disney films pre Renaissance obviously get a bad rep for like. Oh, there are the horns. There we go. Two horns. They get a bad rep, but like I think they're good. I think they're fun. Three horns. Mm -hmm. Hey Tim, how does that make you feel that I found three horns? My riddles are tricky. I'm sure you can Thank you, Tim. tell. Here's puzzle piece five. You're doing quite well. Thanks. Get out of here. Get, get, get out of here, Skelly Man. Hammer. Okay. Yeah. I mean, so how many mouse rooms? There? Yeah, the Great Mouse Detective I really liked. It was very cute. Oh, <gasps> spooky. I liked, um, I like Rescuers. Although, honestly, the original Rescuers film scared me as a kid. Because they, they, they catch a ride in the in the film The Rescuers, the two mice catch a ride on uh on like a pelican? Or some kind of like bird. Um and they land in a city and then the bird gets captured by rats and they try and like eat him. And that scared the shit out of me as a kid, because I was like, they could just gonna eat him alive? Those rats didn't weren't messing around. That scared the hell out of me. But then again I was like five. So like a lot of things scared the hell out of me. Oh <gasps> nut. One nut. Yes, one nut. Oh my god, are you gonna nut again on stream, Skelly Man? <gasps> I need another nut. Where's the nut? There's also Secret of Nim. I love Secret of Nim. Secret of Nim is like a film that I feel like it, it's so difficult to make because it's a kid's film, but it's so serious in tone. Like the stakes are so grounded in reality. My family friend read the horror stream? Don't worry. I think I have an adult tag in there somewhere. I think I have the swearing tag on my stream. That's about it. Because it's like, I'm not naked. Well, I am from the waist down. But I don't have, uh, <laughs> I have no dick, so it's fine. So, like, I'm not, a, like, a sexual streamer. So I don't have to have all of those tags on, thankfully. But, uh, I do swear a lot. So I'm like, you know what? Let me just put the swearing. <laughs> Let me just put the swearing tag on so we can get in trouble. Your biggest skeleton boobs are out. That's true. I'm just like, I'm just letting them flap around, aren't I? <laughs> this is the most, this is the saltiest outfit I've ever worn. Just a hat and like a cape. That's pretty sexy. Damn. I I was tempted. I, I was tempted to like give myself a, like a bit of a, you know, a little, little something that connects to my, uh, to my, uh, to my leg piece, if you know what I mean. But then I was like, Twitch would probably kill me because it would be phallic in nature. So they'd be like, um, even though you're made of Lego, we're going to ban you. So I was like, you know what? Let's not toy with fate. Let's not tempt the the demon today. Uh, it's fine. Also, it would just be out for the whole stream, which would be bad. I have this problem because both the Lego skeleton model and my original Doran model, neither of them wear clothes, but neither of them are like humanoid enough to need them. Because they're both physical, like, they're plastic toys. Um, I am a Ken doll in both senses. So, like, I don't know if I'm in trouble. I don't think I am in trouble, but... I, I, I don't think I'm risking it. But at the same time, I'm always a bit concerned that, like, Twitch is very ban-friendly. Like, like, they're very eager to ban people right now. So I'm like, Ugh. No one draw attention to it and we'll be fine. But, yeah. Exactly, I'm naked most of the time. <laughs> there is an intended for certain audience bit at the top. Yeah. We have to make it to the darn fucks. I mean, I don't have any rules about fun. out. You do what you want. <laughs> I'm definitely just like, a, you know, people can draw me however they want. Although I'd be quite surprised if anybody felt the need to. <laughs> Yippee, flower. <laughs> a flower. I'm not just saying that because I want someone to commission me $300 worth of skebs. Wink. <laughs> nah. The, the only, like, I got, like, very cute, like, honest, like, nice fan art, and I've got silly, stupid memes, but I don't think, uh, I don't think I'm the person to draw, like, sexy fan art for. You thought about it? Oh my god, god damn it. I mean, don't let me stop you. Vine boom. <laughs> I honestly haven't really ordered a skeb myself anyway. I've never, like, I've never ordered a skeb for myself. A 12 Maybe I should. Midnight. 
Every time I'm like, oh, put it back. Every time I'm thinking about ordering a scab. Place. Everything, every time I think about ordering a scab, I'm thinking like, well, why didn't I just order it for a friend? For their character instead. Because they have better character designs and they're cute. And they're probably like, got an amazing cool anime character that probably looks really good in scab. Whereas like, I don't know, I'm just like a guy. I'm just like a green thing. I don't know if a, I don't know if a scab artist would ever accept like my model reference anyway. They'd be like, what the fuck is this? Buzz Lightyear, get out of here. I only draw anime girls with various degrees of clothing. Do not waste my time. You're, ha shell. You're half working on a bit for Boar in his stream? Ayo. Secret, secret, secret. Oh my god, Boar. I mean, see, I feel like you could draw not safe for work out of Boar. That would work because the guy just has like a Boar ha uh, like hat on. So you could just be like semi-naked Bara man with Boar head and it would work so well. You need sprites and budgets for boys and ooh. For boys end, you say. <laughs> God damn it. This stream deck is too far away from me. I have to I have to like reach for it. Get out of here. Bo Bo wouldn't allow no safe for worker. Oh, that's fair. That's that's his decision. I totally get it. Uh, especially if you're like pretty close to the character in terms of like A Bell. That guy from Demon Hunter? Yeah, kinda. Like, I mean, there is that yeah. It would be a similar sort of thing. They both have boar heads, but boar has like a more of a, like a, like a rusty wrench aesthetic to him as well. And he wears clothes. At least more clothes. Time. Ding dong ding dong. Time. And a pin. Okay, was, I should be speed, I should be speeding up. I want to get to the Tim Curry game. A carved violin. Where's the second nut? Oh, it's there. <laughs> the number Two of times nuts. boss being called Inosuke, oh no. That's always a, that's always a problem. A cobwebby name. Hey, where's the fucking hammer? Oh, uh, this hammer. Got it. A Got hammer. it. Yippee! I'm so good. Bro is like giving it to giving it to because me with his toes. Riddle is done, Get out of here. Here is the next puzzle piece that you've won. Yippee. Give me that. I'm out of here. We did ban the word at one point. Don't remember if we still have it banned. That's fair. I remember it being a thing for Snuffy as well, where it's like she made a model and it looked very, very similar to like uh, a Genshin Impact character. And everyone's like, oh my god, Genshin Impact every time. And it was like, yeah, that must get tiring. That must that must get pretty tiring. Uh oh, um, this is kind of hard without all the pieces, but I'm gonna try anyway. Actually, no, it's not hard at all. I lied. Um, actually, I'm a big fat liar. I'm a big fat liar. Cancel me on Blue Sky. <gasps> the giant sea. Can I just like figure it out without all the pieces and then just get out of here? Um, what the freak? There we go. Yippee. Okay. Genshin Impact. <laughs> uh, I haven't, I haven't done all the puzzles in this room yet. Let's do. I spy a fork face. Fork a face? Who are you calling a fork hands. face? Fork face. face on a Yum. 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 I don't like the way you said that. <laughs> yum. Mm. Yum, yum. I see your funny fork face. Oh, you do? Oh, he's got a little face. A fork face. It is a funny fork face. Two nails. And what about the snails? Face on a coin. Where's the face on the coin? A face on a coin. A spider. Yep, 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 yep. A spider. <laughs> Genshin, Genshin players are the most annoying. I would know. Oh, damn the self, the self report. Nah, it's all about the Zenless Zone Zero now, and the withering waves, and the whatever else. There are so many. I can't keep track of them all. There's the three lizard tails. There's a lizard tail. One lizard tail. And another one. Two lizard tails. I love that they animated these all. Three lizard tails. I wonder how they did this. Because, like, these are, like, just, like, photo bashing. These are just, like, real photos that they've just mashed together to make this image. So I wonder how they animated them so well. They're really, like, seamless. I need a nail. There we go. Down, 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 down. One nail. Okay. Where's the third yum? Two nails. Oh, there's a third yum. Found it. I'm getting better, guys. I'm getting better. Yum, yum, yum. Mmm. 
Bro, you don't even eat. You're a skeleton. A spoonful of bugs. I just love- I honestly do love the delivery of all of these lines. Skelly man just gets so into it on all of them. Okay, I'm missing a tongue. Where's the tongue? I see an ear. I see a bone. I see a skelly man. Where's the- oh, where's the tongue? Is it a- oh, it's a snake tongue. Ah. Bro, you're a skeleton? Oh, since when? Since when? When did I turn into a skeleton? Is it because I forgot to eat dinner and then I became a skeleton? That's a problem. That's that's it. That's that's, that's the uh, that's the law. The law is that I was uh, I was busy making my Halloween debut assets and then I forgot to eat dinner and then when I woke up I was a skeleton. It happens. Don't skip dinner. Always eat dinner. That's a rule. Where's this? Where's the two sticks for a drum? Uh, um, it was around here somewhere. I forget where it was. Where the heck did it go? <laughs> I swear they were dead. I swear I remember playing this game before and I'm like, just forgotten it all. I've forgotten it all. There's the bone. There's the fly. There's the skelly man. There's the that. There's the... Oh, there it is. Haha. -ha. Two sticks for a drum. Now, where's the screw? Oh, it's just in the, the saw. Yippee. A screw. <laughs> this is the level of difficulty I need in a game. I can't be playing difficult games. You finished yet another one. Yippee. Keep solving them all until you are done. Uh, okay. Very forceful. Play this. Buy two red bugs. Play this game I forever. Don't... don't ever stop playing this game. One red bug. Where's the other one? Um, where's the other red bug? Oh, that one. Yippee. Two red bugs. Okay, pearl from above. A bee. A pearl from above. A bee. A bee. That's cute. A bone. A bone. A dime. A dime. Okay, now I always have to click five flies, okay. Oh god, I I'm I played Crow I finished Crow Country on Tuesday. That was such a special game. I love that. One fly. The ending was so surprising. I'm not gonna say what it was, but man. I'm still two thinking flies. about that ending even now. Even like two days later, I'm still just like, damn. Flies. I know the secret of 2106, and I don't wanna know the secret of 2106. It scares me. Four flies. You had to be there. I mean, it's all just water the board. Tee hee. Tee hee. But I don't know. I just love, I love indie games that you can beat in two streams and just like have a really nice payoff at the end. Hang out. <laughs> no, please don't ban my VOD to protect it. Delete the VOD. No. The people need it. The, the YouTube people need it. Four flies. Damn, where the, where's the fifth fly? I swear I've clicked them all. Four flies. Okay, have I not clicked this one? Four flies. Have I not clicked this one? Oh, there we go. <laughs> Alright, they do a little dance. Five flies. Yay. Perish, no. An ear. Two dark brown eyes. Oh, one but they're like, oh, but they're gonna trick you because the other dark brown eyes in the wood. Haha. -ha. Two dark brown eyes. Saw teeth. Um. Oh, yeah. Nice. Saw teeth. And and an animal eight. Is that just a spider? Uh, yeah, that's a spider. Wait, no, an animal eight. What do you mean? What the heck do you mean, an animal eight? Like an animal eight of food? What the heck? I'll have to figure it out. Hmm, it's indeed a riddle. An empty plate. Got that. An empty plate. Oh, you mean the snake eight? Oh, it even draws it for you. They're like. And you got it. Eight. Yippee. Yippee. God, my voice is still Here not great. I think I got like a, 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 an autumn eight. cold. I'll be alright though. More riddles now. Please don't wait. Okay. Are you getting like? Oh, are you, they're very excited about these riddle solving. They're like, oh god, you solved another riddle. I can't hold it anymore. Jesus, Skelly man. Oh god, there's so many like things. This is like a really freaky ass house. There's so many like hidden things already. That means we get to play a new indie game next Tuesday. I'm really excited about that. It means we'll probably get through two more the indie workshop. games this month. 
you can use this machine to make some very spooky ghosts. Okay, but I don't need to do this Start to beat the game. Button number one. I'm good. I'll, I'll come back later, maybe. Let's go upstairs. Let's go. Let's go. I spy. Okay, let's go. I want to try. I want to try and read this before the like two hour mark, but we might be struggling <laughs> just a bit. I never know how long this is gonna take. Rax, uh, <laughs> Raxy mouse head, no, waxy mouse head. There we go. A waxy mouse head. Goo. An eye. Ooh. A ladder. Where's that ladder? Oh, uh, why is he pointing at the bell? It's like pointed. Click it. A T back in place. There we go. Uh, no, wait, a T back in... Well, the T is supposed to be there, right? Surely. Scare... Oh, no, scare... Uh, I need to drag the T? What the, what's the heck the T? There it is. Get over there. Ha-ha! A T back in place. A bug crawling up. <gasps> a bug <laughs> I love the sound up. effects so much. I, I wonder how they made them all. A backwards book. Nice. I love this. I love that they've got little squeak, squeaky noises on everything. It's so good. A rat eye that's red. Gyroscope, gimme, gimme, let's go. A gyroscope. And a winner's cup, yippee. A winner's cup. Nice. Oh yeah, and we've got Silent Hill more to play. Uh, Silent Hill more to play, wow. Sentences. Uh, yeah, some more Silent Hill on uh, on Saturday as well. A ladder. I wonder if I wonder how long that will take to beat. Cause I thought it'd be bigger, honestly, not in a bad way. But I guess it's a PS1 game, so there's only so much like stuff You're you can do. You're already done with number nine. Nice. So, what do you think of these riddles of mine? Yeah, they're pretty good. I spy a bell. Oh, well, you are pointing at it. <laughs> Ding dong. A bell. Oh yeah, and I need to. Uh, I need suggestions for like Halloween movies to watch in Discord, cause like on Halloween day or like that weekend, I kind of want to just Two like nails. have Discord be open and constantly uh, just like streaming films to it. Sort of as like a TV thing, you know. A dinosaur tail. Rather than doing it on YouTube, cause like Scary Godmother. Okay, that's a good. That's a good suggestion. A why? Scary Godmother. I've actually never seen Scary Godmother all the way through. That could be a good one. Because, yeah, the idea is, like, I don't know. I'll just, like, I'll just constantly have the stream active. And I'll, either I'll be streaming a movie or I'll be streaming uh, just, like, Halloween commercials. is like, a commercial break. I think that's pretty cute. Because I want, like, it to be something you can just, like, put on a screen and leave it. It's fun. Uh, yeah, I've heard. It looks cute. A spider. There's, like, three scary godmothers. <gasps> Let's watch the scary godmother marathon. I am looking for, like, Halloween films rather than horror films, too. Like... Uh, like, not necessarily, like, super, like, R-rated gory horror. Just, like, you know, silly Halloween films. That's two. What if there's a director a DVD one? <laughs> like, Stuart Little. <laughs> we have a Stuart Little game as well on this computer, but... It's the scariest game we have. The Stuart Little game is scary, so I'm not sure we should be playing it. It might get us banned. It might be one of the banned games for being too scary. <laughs> it's a scary game. An open book? Um... It's one of these, right? Um... I don't know where it is. Oh. You couldn't for the life, couldn't for the life of you remember the name? Was googling it just now? <laughs> yeah. Study. Scary, uh, scary Godmother is the one with the like reboot style three D graphics, um, which is either you either you love it or you hate it sort of thing. I love it. I think they're like charming, but they're slightly uncanny. A green boot that's muddy. Oh, where's the open book? Oh, you got to find the open book. Where could it be? All I see is a picture of a train and an eyeball. And a rat reading a book. Oh no, he's about to be hit by the wax. He's got his AirPods in. Where the heck is it? Where's the open one? I'm not looking hard enough. <laughs> That's like this entire game. I'm just like, the only difficulty in this game is finding the thing. I'm like, where is the thing? Guys, help. Do you know there were books before the movies? Oh, I didn't know either. Actually, no, I think I did and then, like, repressed that memory. I think I remember it now. Yeah. <laughs> they were books. They were, like, based on books. I'm not sure if, if they're, like, an accurate adaptation, though. What the heck is the open book? I want. I need to see some pages. Oh, of course it's the one. Of course it's the one the mouse is reading. What a fool I am. I'm sorry, mouse. I forgot you were reading, too. Yippee. 
Got it. Give me that. You <laughs> Give me that. One more. So what else can we watch? Puzzle piece 10. Hmm. You're not finished yet, but I'm sure you'll know when. Good. There's obviously like Coraline, that's like a famous one, but I'm thinking of what else. I'm really thinking of like direct to DVD or like TV movies, really? DCOMs would work too. Is there like a Halloween? There's Halloween, is, is it um, what is it called? Wishbone? There's lots, there's lots of, we could just like watch a lot of Wishbone episodes that too. Why it's just a wee wishbone. I spy dun, 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 Click dun. on the drawers at the top of your screen to choose objects for your picture. Then, Arrange them however you like. <laughs> which bone? You <laughs> which help, bone do you mean? Click the question yeah. mark. Yeah, I want to watch. Uh, there's like a couple of like spooky, like there's like a Wishbone episode based on like, um, uh, uh Ichabod Crow. Um, yeah, the Ichabod story of like the, the, the Headless Horseman. That's like a classic. Or oh, we could watch classic animations like Ichabod. Yeah. Because that's like, that's like some really classic animation that's like kind of nice to watch around Halloween time. I'm, I am thinking more like unconventional stuff rather than like necessarily modern stuff, I guess. <gasps> That's equal. I spy a first floor. Okay. A first floor. I like how this is just like, this is just like Skelly Man's uh, like, <laughs> like drawing board for spooking me. And I'm like, oh fuck, I've discovered it early. Oops. Three hidden mice. Where's the mice? I hear, I see some jacks. Five skeleton prints. Oh, we're gonna be here all day. Oh no. Five skeleton prints. Nice finger hook. A finger hook. Oh, hidden mouse. I left a mouse. One hidden mouse. Two hidden mice. I love the mouse. Okay, where's the third mouse? Show me. Show me the mouse. Where are you? Are you a drawing of a mouse? Are you a chalkboard of a mouse? Where could you be? There you are. I love. Six plus one equals seven. Three bro was doing mice. some. Bro was doing some difficult work. A chalky six. Nice. <gasps> You're here. Oh, Our that's second me. Second floor. Okay, what else can we watch? The, are there any like Halloween decoms? I'm sure there are. I'm pretty sure I've seen Brutal Moose watch to them or react to them. <laughs> I'm pretty sure Brutal Moose has reacted to some Halloween like decoms before. Or like made videos on them, so uh surely. Surely they'll uh <laughs> A Seven Ghosts book. There's many of them? Oh nice. I haven't seen any of them. I didn't have the Disney channel growing up. God, I think I've said that multiple times. I've told you all about my 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 uh, repressed childhood of never having I'm Disney Jack. Channel. <laughs> I couldn't watch the decoms. I couldn't watch Two the sweet Jacks. life of Zack and Cody. I think that was a D. Three that was in Disney, jacks. wasn't it? Where's the fourth jack? Uh, one, two. Where's the fourth one? Erm. Erm. What the heck? Oh, there it is. You took your saliva. Jacks. Oh, no. The very first decom was Halloween-y. Ah. Oh. It's called Under Wraps, but a moment it came back to life. Oh, that sounds charming and silly. Let's watch that. <laughs> There's so many things I want to watch. I'm writing notes. Scary Godmother. Ooh. Under Wraps. Yeah, I'm gonna like, so I am finally made a blue sky account. Yippee, follow me on blue sky. <laughs> Pre SpongeBob, wow. You finished another. Oh, the mummy was voiced by Patrick. Well. Oh yeah. You'll find your way out. You're smart. I can tell. That's quite funny. I love that. I'm gonna love that. I'm sure. I spy two ghosts. A stopwatch. A star. Uh, I'm scared. Ghost. <laughs> Gulp. Are you you be? Man, okay, I, I, gotta, I gotta remember these. Because that's what, okay, my, I think it's gonna be that weekend. I know it's technically, oh, gulp. Sorry, that's my new favorite sound effect. Why do more streamers have a teeth chatter sound effect? It's so good. Um, But yeah, uh, 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 the plan is like, so Halloween day is the Thursday. So I'll be doing a special stream, wink. I'm not telling you what it is though into like the day um so that will be like the thursday but then like that weekend i think the friday so we'll just we'll say friday night friday from like i don't know 5 p.m my time to like super late i'll just start playing films on my pc and streaming them to discord 
you can like step in and in and out when you want um but yeah and then like between the films i'll just have like halloween commercials playing because that's what i like about like watch alongs is the aesthetic of like you're watching tv so you know we we have the video playing and then i just get some like i don't know halloween commercial compilations to play in the background i think that's cute it gives people time to piss if they want um yeah that's the plan rather than doing it on stream because yeah <laughs> then twitch will kill me again <laughs> two ghosts we did what did we watch we watched like a couple of halloween films a few years ago but i can't remember what they were i mean we watched the original shop of horrors that was quite fun but it was really like amateur can i call it amateur it was really weird because like obviously the the original little shop of horrors not the like fun musical one but like the black and white one it all takes place in the same like three scenes um it takes place in like the plant shop for some reason the dentists the b movie yeah is so bizarre it's like obviously like it, it's got an ensemble cast which isn't a bad thing the problem is they all just start talking over one another like in the scene they'll just be like yapping over one another so it's really hard to know like who's saying the lore important stuff and who's just yapping about their wife or yapping yapping about their like useless husband and it's just like okay but when does the plant come in <laughs> it's like no you have to understand this wife is buying flowers for her like third dead relative this week unrelated to the plot of the plant it's just bizarre and then there's like the like the like um the hacker dentist like the dentist that just does a really bad job on everybody's teeth he's like got a side plot going along and i'm like what again unrelated to the plant in any way i i really thought the whole film would be about the plant but it isn't it's about everybody it's bizarre a stopwatch we also watched what else do we watch we watched like a couple of like really old like black and white films too um i just can't remember the names of them we didn't we didn't watch nosferatu though we didn't watch that um, I did the only the only film I really remember watching was the terrible Loch Ness monster film. That was amazing. It, it was so bad, but I loved it. A place where you are. Um, we're here. That's right. The place where you are. Yeah. The the Loch Ness monster film was amazing because it was like ninety percent like teenagers making out because they're on like summer camp in Scotland for some reason. Um, so it's just teenagers being like, huh, come on, Janine, let's go make out behind the bleachers, except it's in Scotland, so they're, like, making out behind a tree. And then, uh, like, a, a polystyrene Loch Ness monster just flies out of the water and just, like, rams them, and it goes, yeah, and just runs at them. It's really good. It's so low budget, though, but the only issue with those, like, 70s films, uh, especially, like, low budget 70s films, is they didn't have a boom mic they couldn't afford boom mics so all the like dialogue is just raw audio from the camera which means that it's almost illegible to hear any of the text you can't hear what anybody's saying it's just somebody like saying well janine i guess like in the background <laughs> it's terrible but lovely and also the Loch Ness monster makes a tie fighter sound effect so good shit six five letter words god damn it we're gonna be here all day one five letter word can I do that one too? Oh, I can. Two five-letter words. Bro, I'm so good. I'm cracked. I'm cracked. Three five-letter words. Yippee. Dude, I'm so Four good. Four five-letter words. I'm so cracked. Five five-letter words. I really want to watch the the um the eighties Little Shop of Horrors. I think it was the eighties, right? Six five-letter words. Yippee. Pew. Yeah, I really watch. Yeah, I really want to watch the uh, the eighties Little Shop of Horrors. I was about to call it the new one, but I'm like, it's not really new. <laughs> it's new by like Little Shop of Horror standards, I guess. A feather. Yippee. A whistle. Ah, uh, that was right here. Nice. A whistle. A teapot stout. Oh, that's right here too, right? Yeah, there's so many things I want to watch. The the issue was like for for the like uh for the Twitch watch longs, I was trying to find films that were out of copyright, but surprisingly, it's very few. I forget that like copyright is like eighty odd years, so unless the film came out in the the forties, you can't really watch it. Um, there's like a few films that have expired copyrights because they were like incorrectly, like they didn't go to the copyright office in time, so the films never technically were in copyright, but. They can still be DMCA'd for some reason, because the DMCA has never really cared about the logistics of copyright. They just do whatever they want, which is a shame. A spooky get out. Got it. 
Oh no, he's. Why is he like threatening me? A spooky, get out. Why is he scaring me? Okay, a store. Where's the store? Um. Erm. Erm, I actually know where the star is. Uh. I actually don't know where it is. Help. Guys, help. Help me. I don't know where things are. They. Oh, there it is. Found it. Never mind, guys. You can go back to sleeping. A star. It's fine. Okay, help me with the teapot stout. Where is it? I'm so. Uh. I feel like I see these things and then I like look away. Ah, oh, there it is. A teapot spout. I'm gaslighting myself. Oh, oh. Nice. Let me drink some wawa. Oh no, bro's back. I know the way out, but my lips are sealed. If you solve more riddles, it will all be revealed. You don't have lips. You just have like bony teeth. Get out of here. Okay, we're done. We're out of here. I'm um, out of here. I spy a spider. Oh, a oh, this one's cool. Bone, this one has the magnifying glass. Bolt, an old gravestone. A water drop. Swamp. I like this. Okay, eek. Uh, I need a gravestone. Fuck out of here, spider. You just have mandibles, yeah. An old gravestone. I like that. A uh, feather? A bone? A uh, feather? Okay, I- okay, I gotta think- okay, more- more things to watch on Halloween, because I just- I want, like, 12 hours worth of stuff to watch. Which is, like, 12 DCOMs minus the ads, so... It's, like, a lot of things. It's a lot of things to watch. Because I just want to, like, leave it on. And then just, like, come back and watch some of it. But I'll see how much interest there is, because I understand that, like, people are- it's like, it's, I know that watching Discord streams on a, uh, on a phone is really bad. It's, it's really, uh, it's, it's really, uh, it's not fun to watch. A face made of spots. For some reason, Discord streams on mobile are really low audio quality, and I don't know why. It's, like, been a consistent issue for, for me for ages. And, like, a lot of other people have it as well. So it's just like, ugh. So hard to, like, watch Discord streams. On PC, they're fine, but on mobile, it, like... It doesn't quite understand how your headphones work for some reason and starts like crunching the audio. It's like there's no tomorrow. Bro, what the heck? Hello, broken his big ass forehead. Okay, what are we looking for? A spider. Where's the spider? There's a spider. A Get out. Spider. <laughs> Maddie has permanently altered the, my way of speaking. I keep doing the like. I keep doing the like the Roblox kid voice. Where I'm like, um. I don't think that's why. <laughs> just, just like, God, I can't stop doing it. It's a stim now. It's a stim and I'm ruined. I'm going to say that forever. I'm going to be like in the order for like coffee and they're like, what do you want? I'm be like, uh, I'm thinking latte today. I'm thinking maybe a waddy. Maybe a waddy with some extra chocolate, please. Some extra cocoa powder, please. Uh, make sure it's hot, please. <laughs> just like, <laughs> and then I get forcibly removed and banned from this place of establishment forever. There's the nail. Got it. One nail. One nail. Oh, where's the... There's the lightning bolt. Oh God, I'm getting mucusy throat. A Ugh. lightning bolt. Gulp. Oh, where's the feather? There it is. Nice. A feather. We're gonna get it. It might take like... Okay, we'll probably get to the like two and a half hour mark and then we'll go to the new game. I genuinely don't know what the new game's gonna be like though. I, I tested that it worked, but I haven't, like, seen what the game is like. So it'll be an experience for all of us. Um, where's the bone? The bone. That's a skull, but where's the bone? That's the bone. A nice. Bone. Swamp. Where's the swamp? This looks, like, swampish. Uh. Scream? Where's the swamp? They all look kind of swampy. They're all like a little bit swampy. Uh, <laughs> wait, which one could be this? There's an eek. There's a feather. There's a bone. Oh, pfft. it's the word swamp. I'm stupid. Swamp. I need a water drop then. Hmm. What could it be? Hmm. This one is like a little tricky. Cause it's uh. Oh, there it is. Aha. A water drop. You gotta use the magnifying glass and it's already small. 
There's the nail. One nail. Okay. There's another nail. Two nails. I need a third nail. I need a third nail. What could it be? None of these butterflies are pinned, which is like what they would actually be like, which is I'm being tricked. Where's the third nail? Where is it? Is it the word nail? It's not the word nail. There's an iron gate though. Iron gates have nails, right? Two yellow tails? Truly nailing it. Boom! <laughs> get One get the fuck out of here. Um, I'm reporting you to the police. I say goodbye to your house, Two buddy. Two yellow tails. Ah, uh, I'm gonna use your be nice, please. <laughs> God damn it. Where's the third nail? Okay, you got that nail. I got that nail. Where's the other nail? There's a bug. Get the fuck out of here, bug. You ain't invited. Bone boy, kill him. Bone boy, actually kill him, please. <laughs> I'm gonna set this guy on you. I'm gonna set this little skeleton guy on you. You might think that like a skeleton that's only six inches tall won't be able to do anything. You're wrong. He'll climb up your trouser leg. And don't, <laughs> you don't wanna know what he's gonna do once he's there. Let's just say he's gonna take a bone of his own. Oh. Where the fuck is a nail? There's a, there's a ghost, there's a, there's a tombstone. I got that already. An old gravestone. Yeah. Uh, there's an owl. That's pretty neat. There's a... Uh, I'm sure it's like in the details somewhere, like really awkwardly. There's the tree. That's a crack. Not not of an ass, but of a wing. There's the words. Oh, it's hiding under the wing. How sneaky. Mars twisted pee, pee Three nails. <laughs> wow. Nice. He's coming out. Gimme, give gimme. Give You've solved 13 riddles. You're yippee. halfway done. Halfway? Solve what? 13 more, and the game I didn't realize there were 26. Oh, God. Okay, this might take a stream. Guys, guys, scream. God damn it. I didn't, I didn't realize. Scream. Oh, God damn it. Okay. We've got to, we've got to really speed up. <laughs> I gotta stop fucking around. We've got to, like, speed run this stuff. A broken wing. I can do it. I can do it if I believe in myself. Oh god, the yellow beak is already over. It's already over. There it is. A yellow beak. Okay. We have to speed up. Iron gate. Butterfly eek. <laughs> That's great. Butterfly eek. That's pretty good. Three. A three. A fly? I wonder what a speedrun of this game looks like. A fly. A leafless tree. Ah, oh, we just need a frown out. Got it. A skull. Oh, no, that's the skull. Where's that frown, then? Where's that sad face? Where are you, sad face? Oh, that's a frown. Oh. He's like, oh, my wife left me. Now I'm a ghost and divorced. Oh. Oh, jeez. Who, who gets the haunted house and the divorce? <laughs> There are more puzzle pieces you still haven't seen. You're at halfway plus one now. That means 14. Oh, my ghost wife took the haunted house and the divorce. Now I need to go and haunt a condo. <laughs> okay, I'm fucking out of here. That would be quite funny if it was just like a bunch of like <laughs> condos that were haunted by divorce ghosts. They're so they're, what's that ghostly wailing? Oh, he's just thinking about Mar Mary again. Oh, Mary. Oh, I've already done this bit. Get out of here. Get the fuck out of here. I've done that. I've done that. Okay. Uh, we gotta go into this. Creepy collection. Uh, never, never mind. <laughs> My we ghost wife to took the ghost the kids. Oh no. Have something in common. Know what it is? Uh, I don't care. Get out of here. Fill the empty shell. No, get out of here. By clicking Skedaddle. on the objects that belong I hate in this collection. <laughs> Okay, I'm out of here. Ready, See ya. Set, go. No, I'm good. Bye. Uh, I gotta go in here now. Oh god, there's so many more rooms I forgot. I spot. Okay, full moon. A full moon. Okay, uh, three bows. There's a bow. One bow. There's another bow. It's really tiny though. That's so cheeky. Two bows. And now you have a mouse. Oh, he's so cute. The nose of a mouse. I think those mice are like 3D like little furry puppets that they've posed. That's really cute. So it's kind of like stop motion. Hello. Oh, that's oh, creepy so though. <laughs> I really don't like the creepy ass doll. 
An eye back in place. A needle. Um, a foot with no toes. Um. 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 What should, what foot, what foot don't have, oh, it's the fucking ruler. Haha, <laughs> sneaky. A foot with no toes. Clock face. A face with no eyes. Bow, got him. Ruler, I hardly Three think foes. about your next words carefully. Where's the heck is the needle? There it is. A needle. Where's the, where's the footprints? Um. <gasps> the mouse footprints. Oh. <gasps> I'm far what too prince? easily entertained by this, but whatever. I love fighting the things. <laughs> God damn it! The delay. Thread. The delay. God damn it! We gotta speed this up. This book only costs twenty nine cents. Damn, Macklemore would love. How many have you gotten from me? Here's a hint. It's eighteen minus three. Oh, don't don't like prank me like that. I spy a tail. Three stars. Well, there's a tail. A tail. Well, we already found the moon, but I need another moon, I guess. Oh, uh, there's a moon. Uh, moon? Moon? Oh, the word moon. Gotcha. Moon. Three stars. Oh, there's one star. I need three stars in a row. There we go. Ha <laughs> ha. My name. Got it. Three stars in a row. Two bells. Two bells. Two bells. We're going mid. He's low. Your He's low. Name. He's one. He's low. Two bells. He's entered. We need three nines. Oh my goodness. There's one nine. One nine. There's two nines. Two nines. Where's the third? And then there's three nines. Nine, nine, nine. Three nines. Yippee. Uh, nail. Got it. Do, 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 do. A nail. Open pen. Got it. A body text. Oh, this body is so pin. cute. Oh, oh, he makes a little squeaky noise. In. Oh, he's adorable. A uh, tiny black crow. That's not too small. A tiny black crow. Now I just need the light switch. That's the last thing I need. Oh, there it is. A oh, no, you switch. scared the mouse, you asshole. How dare you? How dare you scare the widow mouse? Okay, uh, nuclear bomb, whoever did that. Oh, no, that's me. Nuclear bomb, me. Piece 16 is what you have won. You'll get out of the house when the message is done. <laughs> P16 is what you have won. If you want to get out, use this gun. <coughs> we gotta shoot our way out, boys. It's only a wooden door. We can get out of here. Um. Have I done this? I oh god, so many. A handstand. Alright, bet. <coughs> oh god, we got creepy child photo and various creepy dolls. The dog is kind of cute, but then every other doll is like soulless and scary. Oh no! A boy in a frame. It's gonna be me soon. A boy in a frame. Yippee! A handshake. A rickety chair. A rickety chair. <laughs> what is this like cunty rabbit? I'm sorry. Why is this cunty rabbit sitting like this? Crossed legs. That's great. The little top hat. The little bunny is serving. He's serving like a doll cunt. Four braids of hair, okay. Where's the, oh, this doll is the creepiest one. I don't know, I don't like that face. Two braids Scary. of hair. And another two. The two little dads. Four braids of hair. Blue jeans, hell yeah. Bro, put your fucking foot down, Jesus. A pair of blue jeans. You, yo, yo, loop. Yippee. A yo, yo, loop. Girl in the hoop. Talented. A girl in a hoop. Saddle. Um. Um. That was like. What was it? It was around here. What was it? The saddle. Uh. Like a horse saddle, right? What the heck? It's a. There it is. Yippee. A saddle. Nice. Oh, I love the little like knitted doll in the middle as well. It's cro it's like a crochet. It's like a crochet thing. I don't even know what it's supposed to be, but it's cute. I want one of those. Find the way out. That is your goal. Ghost number seven plays a special role. Find the way out. That is the goal. If you want to get out, I you'll show me Jack. your hole. Green eyes staring. Gotta have it. I spy Jack. Uh, hit the road, Jack. 
what the heck? It's like, I'm looking for like a playing card, but I'm sure it's something else. Uh, a nose that is blue. Who's got a blue nose? I just like making the stupid rhymes. A nose that is blue. Where's the three cats? Meow, meow, meow. Uh, there's two cats. Where's the third cat? Where the heck? Show hole to get out of this puzzle. What if Saw was freaky Saw? And instead of murdering you, he was just like, show feet. <laughs> oh, I want to play a game. To get out of this deadly trap, you'll need to show me your toesies, you little tootsie wootsies. And the girl's like, I'd rather die. He's like, well, so be it. I have never watched a single Saw film all the way through. I find the premise very silly, though. Where it's just like, I'm going to kill you in a really convoluted way for, like, funsies. Um, it's not so much the... I mean, I, I'm, I'm... Obviously, the lore is there. The story is there to make entertaining, like, situations. But the, the more seriously you take Saw, the less entertaining it becomes. Because it's like... Am I supposed to believe this guy is a real murderer doing all this really complicated shit with laser beams and stuff and no one noticed? Like, come on. Yeah, I feel like the it's, it's got to be like, you know, glampy horror. Then it's like, well, so, then I enjoy it more. But when they start talking about the Saw extended universe, I'm like, all right, I don't care anymore. Where the fuck is the third cat? I need to find the third cat to be in the cat wall. Please. I've, like, done none of these. Green eyes staring at me. I mean, blue eyes stare is right there. But where's the green eyes? There's the red eyes. Oh, there they are. Ah. Green eyes staring at you. Four hats that are red. Oh, we're going to be here all day with the four One hats. One hat that is red. Two hats that are red. Okay, let's go. Nice. Three nice hats flip. that are red. Nice. Four hats that are red. Okay, horns. Gotcha, gotcha. One horn. One horn. Oh, there's a second cat. Get him over there. Nice. Three cats in a row. Second horn, let's go. Two horns. Fly on ahead. Surely. There it is. Get out of here, fly. Top hat. A fly on a head. Top hat is on the country rabbit. Very nice. A top hat. A top. Oh, fuck. Erm. Um, <laughs> where's the top? Let's look at the other. Let's look at the other screen because it's bigger. Um, oh, there's the eyeglasses. Oh, this is the top. Eyeglasses. It's really rusty, though. Gotcha, gotcha. A top. It's just the jack now. Where the fuck is the jack? Is there a guy called Jack? Are we, I'm looking for like a card jack. Oh, no, it's a jack like a. Ah. Uh, like that, Jack. Jack. Ah, gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. I'm smart. I figured it out. Let's go. Nice. Here's a small secret. In you, I'll confide. It's the get out ghost who will take you outside. Bro, you've like spoiled the ending like four times now in a row. <laughs> He's like, I, I know you haven't solved the puzzle yet. However, let me just tell you anyway. I spy a okay. Oh, I'm thinking, oh man, I really can't wait to like live in a house, like living in like, like live in a bigger space because my current space is really small. Um, a bar of soap to save money. But if I move when I move to a bigger space, expect like hand cam streams because I would love to do like baking streams and stuff. I think that'd be really fun. A toothbrush because they're like kind of perfect because like. Cooking something and baking it in the oven, like, roughly takes about an hour and a half to two hours. So it's, like, a pretty decent... You could do two of them in a stream and it would work. And I don't want to do, like, an easy bake oven. I don't want to, like, buy a big plastic crap oven. I want to use a real oven, you know? Yeah, exactly. Hand comes stream for one hand. Exactly. That's why there's fun. That's why it's funny. <laughs> that's, why there's, that's why there's some, like, you know... How would you make a hand cam stream interesting? Simple. Use, use a prosthetic. It's, f it's like, it looks cool. Plus, it probably won't work very well, which is even funnier. One jack. <laughs> Ooh, hat. Two jacks. A gripper on a pole. Gripper? Where's the pole? There's a pencil. But yeah, I think that'd be funny. Because, like, this prosthetic is, uh, it's pretty useful, but it's not, like, the most sophisticated thing in the world. So I think trying to do anything with it is semi-entertaining anyway. So I, I want to share that joy with everybody. Oh, it's literally a the grip. grip on a pole. Okay, square pitch frame. 
Nice. Don't know why there's like Solomon of the Turkish Empire in that painting. <laughs> Literally like giant like Turkish emperor in that painting. Every every house needs one. A nine. A God. nine. Now it's a six. You fucked up. Candle flame. A candle flame. Silver handle. Er, there we go. A <gasps> silver handle. And a brown bottle cap. Or oh, that one. Uh, or not. Or what the heck? Brown bottle cap. Brown. Brown. Is that not a brown bottle cap? Whatever. I'm assuming they mean like a. Oh. <laughs> Stupid. A brown bottle cap. A trap. A trap. Nice. I gotta think of like more hand cam stream ideas. Cause like I've got cooking, I've got Lego. I'm thinking what else? Origami maybe? I think origami would the be quite cool. Ghost can't be made yet. The mystery drawer holds the things you must get. Okay. Bro was taking a bath. His like scalusi is out. A hand. I do not want to see your scalusi. Put it away. One pencil. Imagine if I invited you all to my house and then I just locked the door behind me and then made you solve a bunch of riddles while I hang out in my bathroom. That would that would not be a good way of like that's not a good introduction. But like, hello, come into my home. I definitely would lock you in here and make you solve twenty six riddles. While I like follow you around the house, like making creepy gestures. It's no good. Someone's gonna tell him this isn't okay. Two pencils. Dude, I thought we were just gonna like order a pizza and watch a film. This is too much. A comb. A comb. Uh, a hand. A hand. A bug on a wall. A bug on the wall. A six. <laughs> A six. <laughs> Joke's on you. I just need two hairpins to unlock the door and get out. Damn it. Now I'm going to have to invite him back. I mean, that's what this game does. They're just like, thank you. Thank God you finally escaped. Anyway, if you want to, like, get locked in here again. Flower, that's wink, red. wink. It's so like, dude, I'd never want to come back here. That's a lie. I play this game, like, multiple times a year. Uh, damn. A that... little bathtub. Wallpaper head. Bro, why do you wink at me like a that? Wallpaper head. Even the walls are coming on to me. I'm not a fan. A name that is yours. Yeah, that's mine. Three doors. One, One door. door. Two doors. Two doors. Stockholm Syndrome and Ice Spice Spooky Mansion? More lucky than you think. Three doors. Nice. We're so close. This took a bit longer than I thought, but that's fine. Oh, the dude, he fucking dried locked. himself off with a piece Where's of paper. The key? You'll find the answer in the message from me. Okay. He's just going straight back in the bath. He's like dipping his little toes in there. Okay. Where now? Let me go to the attic. There we go. I spy a skate. Oh, the dark. A the dark one is the frame. worst. <laughs> the dark one is the worst. I forgot. A skate. That's a snake. One snake. I forgot that there's a dark mode at the end of this game. It just makes it so much harder. Oh god, black picture frame in the fucking dark. Oh, and a boo. And a boo. <laughs> a monster face. Gulp. Is that gulp your penis? <laughs> I keep seeing the yeah, I keep seeing this funny tweet, so it's just like, is that gulp a your bat. peanuts? I saw. I saw that. Ha ha, get it? I saw it. Ha ha ha, get it? Laugh at my joke. I laugh at my joke now. I read it. I'm sorry. <laughs> That's the black picture frame. Got it. Speaking of. A black picture frame. Speaking of Stockholm Syndrome, how are my chatters doing today? <laughs> uh, a ball for a game. A ball for a game. A kazoo? Damn. I know a lot of streamers with kazoos. It's it's like a pretty like fun thing to just have. <laughs> a cage. How is my paid audience doing? How are my paid actors? A kazoo. You on kazoo. Where's the fucking snake? Get out of here. I see you up there. Two snakes. Two snakes. A sowl. A sowl. Where's the sowl? <gasps> the boo paid. Oh, uh, yeah, right? You get paid in channel points. Haha. -ha. 
You get paid enchantment points that you can use in my store. It's just like those like mining towns in the American 1800s. You work for me and I pay you in uh, tokens that you can only use in my store that I own. Smile. This is definitely not illegal, Smile. This isn't payment. Oh, shit. The feds are going to be on me. Where the fuck is the chair? I might have to pay you per thing you help me out with. <laughs> where's the chair? Where's the chair? I see a creepy ass doll. I see a top hat. Uh, there's a chair. Why is it on the ceiling? Get it out of there. A wooden chair. You're getting paid like, I don't know, 0.78 gambles per hour. You watch me. I might have to change that ratio. I want people to gamble at least once an hour, but I don't know. It's hard to know the calculations. Or I'm too stupid to work it out. Actually, I'm I'm not too stupid. I'm just lazy. <laughs> I could work it out if I wasn't being so lazy. A candle. Where the fuck is the sword though? I already clicked that. Get it out of here. A black picture frame. Where's the sword? It's probably on the ceiling. Like everything else in this game, they just plonk it wherever they feel like. They see the little fish. Where is it? Saw, 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 saw. Saw, saw, saw. Where are you? There's the boo, there's the car, where's the sow? Where the heck? Where the heck could you be? I'm gonna go crazy. Oh, there it is. Haha! -ha. Nice. Saw. Sow. Okay, we're good. You get more dark rooms to do. Do I even. I don't even know where the last room is. I I've, I've thought it would be You'll up here, but it's just one. The message frame. You are now even closer to winning the game. Yikes. He's got that, like, shounen anime boy voice. I He's like, oh, jeez. Deku. It's cat. me, Deku. A face in a frame. A necklace. I have to keep trying hard for my friends. <laughs> oh, spooky hat. A dusty top hat. Two hangers. I got one of them. Nice. One hanger. Oh, where's the other one? It was around here. There we go. Two hangers. Nice. A face in a frame. Oh, tail of a cat. Oh, God. Okay. Oh, uh, that's going to be tricky. Where the hell is it? This goddamn cat could be anywhere. <gasps> Fish. A loop in a string. Uh huh. Tip of a ski. The tip of a ski. Cat tail. What the heck? I mean, I can barely see what any of these things are, which doesn't help. Um... There's a car. There's a bunch of crap on the ground. Uh, a single earring as well. That was like down there, right? There we go. A single earring. Bro, that's a big ass earring for some big ass ears, I assume. We got fucking Dumbo over here. Dumbo serving. Oh, okay, so it's just a sulk. Bro, I don't want to click on somebody's, like, gro grody ass like, dusty-ass sock that's been left in the attic. E that's one dusty sock. Needs some Walsh. Hey, Mako, what's up? How's it going? This thing, Donkey Kong, the best way? Yeah! This game came out, like, 25 years ago, thus it's the best game ever. How's your Thursday going? Oh, there's the cat. <coughs> Meow. The tail of a cat. Meow. <laughs> We must be closed, right? Skelly man, give me your paper. Well, 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 well. Up to piece 22. There are four more to earn. See? I'm counting for you. Ugh, great, okay. But where are the rooms? Like, I don't remember where the rooms are. So we did that. We did these. Did all these. Did you do that? No. Did that. Oh, this. I spy a spider, a feather, a bow. Didn't I do this? A lightning bolt. Didn't I? Old gravestone. I did that, right? I did this. Why is it like saying I didn't do it? I'm confused. I swear I did that. You saw me do it. Why is it like not counting? That's bizarre. Find the right. I'm pr I'm like not I'm like a hundred percent sure we just did that. Oh well. Maybe it didn't count for some reason, or maybe we have to do it twice. But it's the same riddle, so I don't know. I'm confused. I'm confused, guys. I think this game might be busted. 
No, did these papers even fit together? Okay, we're good, we're good. We're gaming. Oops. Uh, oops. They're like, just like throw the paper all over the thing, why don't you? This guy does not have, this, this guy does not know how to make jigsaw puzzles. Uh, huh. Huh. I wonder if I could just figure it out without doing the last couple. I wonder if that's an option. It'd be quite funny. Be like, ah, I solved it already. Yeah, it's cool that you got more puzzles for me to solve, but I don't care. I'm just out of here. Oh, hit. Solve a riddle in the cabinet of keys in order to earn this puzzle piece, please. Gulp. Uh... I've hidden some things in the mystery drawer. Take them out and you'll see what they're for. So yeah, we just have to make ghost number seven then we're out of here basically, but I'll do the last four. It's good, they're unproductive so far. Gonna cook dinner and attempt dessert in a few hours. Ooh, what you gonna make for dessert? <gasps> this. I spy Aha, I found the extra drawer. A star. Hey, as long as you like cook a good meal, it's a productive day in my mind. Skeleton face, let's go. Your name. A skeleton face. Gulp. A key in a lock. Easy. A key in a lock. Nice. Bent clay clip. Let's go. A bent paper. Clip. What are they? What is this game's obsession with jacks? Like, it, it's jacks. dating itself slightly with that because I don't think people play with jacks that often anymore. Have bananas that went too brown? <gasps> banana pudding! Oh, it replaced the banana with the emote. <laughs> nice banana pudding. That's cool. Don't worry about it. Smile. A lens with a crack. Oh, a lens with my a bad, crack. bro. I broke it. Where's that fucking frog? Froge? Any froges? Any frugs? Frug. A frog. Paper shoe? Or... There we go. It's peanut butter a jelly. Shoe. Okay, where's the two? Where's the two? There's the K. There's the four and five. Where's the mystery door? Oh, the mystery door key. Where's the two? Where's the two? Where is it? Oh, there it is. Ha ha. A two. I need more. I need more like uh like two thousands of moats to add. I've got the banana peanut butter jelly banana. I've got this. I've got the like bunchies. One Do people remember the bunchies? They look like plus this. One is three. That's how many more pieces you'll get from me. I love the bunchies. I spy two spiders. Spiders. <laughs> That's a cute noise for a spider. spider. It's going blah, blah, blah. A shadowy X. Whoa. What the heck? Oh, there it is. Ah, clever. A shadowy X. Upside down key. Nice. An upside down key. Red K? No, that's regular K. Where's a red K? Special K? Uh... A three? Got a three, two, one, zero. Huh? Mystery draw. Okay, that's that. Throwback Thursday for real? A yeah. With a key to the mystery drawer. Two keys on a chain. Oh, I got a fucking chain on. Two keys on a chain. That's what I read that's what I originally called the corruption streams. I originally called them throwback Thursdays. I honestly now that I'm doing the corruptions like off stream and compiling them, I might just make I just might just make Thursdays throwback Thursdays again. And we just play all games. <laughs> that being said, I play all games anyway. So like <laughs> Oh thank you for the uh four glorps. That'll help me. Hee <laughs> hee. So yeah, I might just play, I, that's the only issue is like, I can't really have a special day where I play all games because that's all I play. I only play all games, really. I don't like playing new games. A thumb. A four, where's a four? There's the K. A red K. Where the heck is, oh, there's the four. A four. Oh, well, a four. Bro, why did he just say it like that? He's like, a four, dummy. Idiot. I was like, eh. Where's the spider? I see a lot of webs, but I don't see any extra spiders. I see that spider. Where's the other spider? Is it on the key? Oh, it's on the lock. Haha. <laughs> Two spiders. Now, where's the three? Where's the three? Is it on a key somewhere? I can barely see. Haha, <laughs> that rhymed. 
I see the two. I see the four one. Oh, there's a three. No, there's a five. Fuck. <laughs> Damn it. Where's the three? I'm gonna look at the stream screen again because it's like bigger. Where are you? Where are you? Oh, there it is. Yeah, looking at the stream screen is easier. Three. We just have to do two more, then we're done. Two more, then we can finally escape. Get me out of here. Here's another puzzle piece for you. How many are left? It rhymes with boo. Seven. Okay. Where was the lo where was the last room actually? I don't remember where it is. Let's like go back here and figure it out. Tell me the room. Find the right. Okay. Uh. Double, double, toil and trouble. Solve the riddle where pots of stew bub. Okay, it's the kitchen. Did I never go to the kitchen? That's stupid. <laughs> How did I miss that? How did I miss the? Where even is the kitchen? Wait a minute. I know why I missed the kitchen. Where the hell is the kitchen? Where the hell is the kitchen? Surely it's on the ground floor, right? Why would you put a kitchen upstairs? I'll just look. Uh, we did. I spy a bar of. Oh, no, we did that. Where the fuck is it? Where the heck's the kitchen in this game? We did this. We did those. We did those. Where the heck is it? Where's the kitchen? It's gotta be downstairs, right? It wouldn't be anywhere up here. I'm like getting lost in Ice by Spooky Mansion. There's gotta be a fucking. <laughs> There's gotta be a like a like a some sort of like record. Getting lo getting lost in the fucking <laughs> getting getting lost in this place. Ice. No, we did that. We've done this. That's a game. Where the fuck is the kitchen door? I don't know where it is. That's the front door. I thought it was off of- Oh, is that a- Oh, that's a door. Okay. I thought that was just a cupboard. Oh, yeah. Oh, <gasps> sneaky lizard song. I like the sneaky lizard song. Give me the fork. Where's the fork? A five as well. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. The letter B. The letter B once. Oh, we have to find it again. There's the fork. A fork. Steamy hands. A steamy, oh, a steamy head. head. Uh, where the heck is a five? There's a six. I have a fish. Where's the fish? There it is. The word spice. Fish. Yeah. The word spice. And the extra B, we got it, boys. The letter B twice. A knife. Where's the knife? I need to stab somebody. <laughs> I need to stab a small skeleton. Don't worry about it. Nah, don't you worry about it. <gasps> the chili bubble. A bug that is red. Oh. Three cats. Meow. One cat. Where's the extra meow? They wouldn't be in the soup, would they? There's a cow. There's a cow. There's a cat. Two cats. I'm sweepy. Oh, where's the cat? Where's the <laughs> I said cow again. Where's the cat? Come on. Kitty. Psst, 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 psst. Kitty. Frog, kitty. That's not a fucking dinosaur, I think. Bro, there's a fucking dinosaur in this game. That's fucking crazy. Skeleton. That's a scorpions, bugs. What am I looking for? It's cat, five, and a knife. I gotta look at the stream. I gotta look at the stream again. I can't see it. Uh. Eyes. Tortoise, four. Moon. Broom. Teacups. Spices. Fly in ladle. Bugs. No, I don't want to. Where the fuck is it? I actually don't see it. Unless it's like a picture somewhere. There's the eye. Got they got that cat. Got that fish. 1882. Chile. Lizard. Bug. Oh, there's the cat. Oh, that is a picture of a. Is it a cat? That looks like a cat. Surely. Oh no, that's the cat. What the hell's that one then? Maybe, oh, that's an owl. <laughs> Three cats. I don't know why I didn't see that as a cat. Why is a fucking knife then? So a knife and a five. Damn, bro. Hardest one. Hardest one yet. There's a four. Oh, there's the five. A five. Is that a knife? I just need a knife now. Not those, not those. 
You don't get penalized for clicking everywhere, so that's what I'm gonna do. We got the fork. A fork. Where's the knife? Three cats. I need the knife. It's not hanging up, is it? Uh, nah. Bro, help me find the knife. Help. Please help. I'm stupid. I think I might actually be stupid this time. A knife shouldn't be hard to recognize even in England. Man, get the man, get the fuck out of here. I'm gonna put you in the lizard stew. Mmm, lizard stew. It's probably like, this game is just like, I'm actually not looking for a knife, you're looking for the word knife. Or a picture of a knife. Just to fuck with you. It's not the fucking dinosaur though, I keep clicking the dinosaur being like, what if dinosaur? What if they were lying? And it's a dinosaur. Gambling! Once again, he gambles. Instead of helping me. I I'm actually stupid. I cannot I cannot for the fucking life of me see this. I'm gonna start clicking randomly at this point. This bottle. I oh no, it can clack uh, it hit the cats by accident. No. Cats. There's the P, these are the four. I really can't see it. Spatula, spoon, pot, bugs. I believe no. I failed at the last hurdle of I Spy Spooky Mansion. It's gotta be like hiding behind something else, just to really mess with you. Just to really fuck with you. Help me out, bitch. Help, help me out, skelly man. A lizard. A lizard. Fucking crazy, bro. Bug. Bug, help me out, buddy. I know I've like turned you into soup, but please. Seriously, I'm like drunk and insane. Like, it's just one thing, but like, I don't fucking see it. I don't think they added a knife to the scene. I think they pranked me. I think they realized I was playing on a uh, a bad version of Windows XP. Yes. They've banned me from beating the game. I see a turtle. I see the soup. I see ICU 1882. Bro, I I need I need to walk through. I need to walk through for Ice by Spooky Mansion. No. I refuse. I refuse to believe I need a, a walkthrough for this. Head. I've been looking. Three cats. You already had that one? No. I just, uh, to be fair, I think I remember I, this caught me out last time. This did catch me out last time. I think I remember now. It was like really subtle. But then again, I'm like, I don't remember where it ended up. Four cat owl G. Broom, chiles, the spice rag. I remember it being really subtle, but at the same time, I'm like, oh, where, but where was the solution after all that? It wasn't these bugs. It wasn't the stovepipe. It wasn't the hands. It wasn't the fork. It wasn't the needle. It wasn't the chiles. It wasn't the scorpion. If I click down there, it'll be the cat. I remember it was like staring me right in my face, but I don't remember where. Oh, there it is. A knife. Look at how fucking subtle that is, though. Look at how subtle that is. That's so subtle. It's on the fucking box spice rack. There it is. One more puzzle piece. You are a son of a bitch, Skelly Man Jones. I get out. You'll get out too. I'm gonna use you as a pepper shaker, you son of a bitch. I spy a needle. Yeah, fuck you. I'm gonna get it. This will probably be easy. A needle. It's so evil, right? I know it caught me out last a time. Dinosaur spine. A spice jar in place. Put it back. A spice jar in place. The first bug in line. Oh. Handrail. The first bug in line. Blue eye. A handrail. Blue eye. Who was that? A rebus door. See, I don't know what the fuck a rebus door is, but apparently it's that. <laughs> Apparently it's a fucking oven door. The shape of a moon. This came out in the 90s. I don't think this, this Arebus door has been a thing for a hundred years. Bugness spoon. Too easy, mate. Oh, we just fucking- A bug in a spoon. We just roasted that fucking bug in a stew. God damn. That's fucked up. We just killed him. He's dead now. That bug is dead. It's all your fault. Now where's the goddamn blue eye anyway? Fucking feel, feel like uh, Yugi. With my blue eyes, white dragon. Good. I just read that in like Zelda CDI voice. Good. Blue eye. 
there's that. Mm, I'm sure it'll be like a subtle. It's not really an eye. I see you. Yeah, that's the Rebus door, though. How is this my fault? <laughs> I'm sorry, it's a not. Rebus door. Yugi is like, oh, God. You dunked it. Oh, yeah. I'll fucking dunk that shit. I just need some blue eye. This is good. This is again going to be like some. Some bullshit. <laughs> some bullshit. I don't see any white dragons around here, so I don't know about that. Again, this is like the last one on this, and it's it's also tricky. I'm not seeing it. A spice jar in place. Yeah, but where's the blue eyes, huh? A blue eye. Give me a hint. <laughs> Give me a hint. I see a blue G. I see a. I see a, a red chile. I don't see anything else that's blue in this scene. So it's got to be a trick. It's got to be yet another trick. This skelly man fuck just wants me to stay here forever. What an ass. Oh, come on. There's the bone in the stew. This is a shitty stew. I know that's the point, but still. A blue eye in the stew. Oh, that is an eye. Wow, I could I could barely make that out. A blue eye. That blended in with the milk so much. But we fucking done it, everybody. This deserves a yippee, but I don't have one, so we'll do an applause. Here's your last yippee. piece. Yippee! You're finished. You're done. Decode the secret message, and this game will be won. Thank fucking God. Let's get the fuck out of here. Let's get the heck out of here. Okay, let's uncover the secret the message. Right. Okay, I'll put it in. <gasps> here we go. I can print this off if I want to. It's time to get out. Are get you ready out. Now? Yep. I wrote this message to show you how. Okay. Upstairs, play creepy collections. We have to play creepy collections. Okay. I get it. Let's go upstairs, play creepy collections. I just have to hit all the keys. Is that Frida Kahlo? Is that, is that a JPEG of a real cat? That's kind of funny. I love that they just got like so many random JPEGs here. Uh oh. Oh god. It goes so fast. Yippee! Here is the key you're looking for. Yeah. Did you know? It opens the mystery drawer. Did you know? <laughs> Did you know gaming? Okay. I have the key item. I can progress. Let's go in here. Oh my god, he's in here too. Bro killed himself. I got my- Enter if you dare. I got lobstered. What? Two gates. Why are we getting lobstered? One smoky chimney. Me and the lantern. When this drawer is empty, in the workshop will be all the things you need for Go 7. Even me. <laughs> He's so cheeky. He's such a little shit, but I love him. Or her, honestly. Okay, how do I get ghost number 7 anyway? Uh, I actually didn't read how to do this. Oops. Oh, guess number seven. There we go. Let's click it. Get out. Got it. Go. Make the ghost. Just blend them up, why don't you? In order to escape this this skeleton's lair, we have to blend them up. I get it. Nice. Thunk. <gasps> the get out ghost. It's the skelly ghost. Oh, I remember this now. We have to turn the skelly man into a ghost to escape. Blender, you hardly... Get out of here. I'm... I'm... I'm the get out ghost now. Get the fuck out of here. Bro. Did he just, like, teleport me out, I guess? <laughs> Bro is like 
after effectsing all over the place. And then they close the gate forever. Donk. We did it, yippee. Yippee. Bro, what's it giving me now? Have I like a churro? You got out. Oh, we you can print this here. I hope you had fun. I be Here's it. an award to show that you've won. I win. You can go back inside. Yippee. The doors Let's open go. For you. you can replay the riddles and all the games too. Okay, I think I'm gonna hit the big stop button though. Bye. <laughs> nice. Okay. Oh god, scary jump scare. Scary boar jump scare. Uh oh. <laughs> I forgot. Okay, well, maybe we don't need to resize it because we're going to open up the next game now, which is, uh, Frankenstein FMV game. Are you ready? <laughs> Frankenstein FMV game. Okay, this is... I haven't tested this one, so it might be horrible, but we'll give it a go. Frankenstein through the eyes of a monster. Uh, run Frankenstein in the eyes of a monster. 1995 from California. Here we go! Interplay! Ooh. Oh my god, this actually has this actually has a tag on Twitch. Where am I? Tim Curry! What's happening to me? Gabrielle! Gabrielle! Where are you? I don't want to remember this. Gabrielle! Come back! Who's calling at this hour? This is like I'm bizarre. sorry, Philip, but you are under arrest for the murder of your daughter, Gabrielle. You bet. But, but I just come along. Now! I'm so invested already. For the heinous crime of murder, you your it, own daughter, I sentence you to hang by the neck until dead. May God have mercy on your soul. I'm innocent! This is, this is so good already. Oh god, Tim Curry is killed in the first 60 seconds of this game. So yeah, that's the backstory, I think. <gasps> there he is. Oh no, Tim Curry's the doctor, my bad. He's alive. Alive! I... I have created life. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That will make you feel better. Just a bit of drugs for a your toast. system. In celebration, Wait. I have made a man. Bro, he's injecting himself too. Oh God. <laughs> Bro is doing mm, time to do some heroin, but it's cool because it was the 1800s. Everyone was doing it. Okay. Yeah. So we're basically playing as Frankenstein's monster, I think. My hand. It's. Good God. It's the hand of a woman. Good God. What has this vile bastard done to me? Yeah, so this is a really old style FMV game. <laughs> you can stand. Tim Curry JPEG. And you're walking. No residual dizziness. <laughs> we trans to my gender? No. Excellent. Can you hear me? Yeah. Anything? Perhaps you can read lips. N no, no. You must be able to hear. Perhaps the cat's got your tongue. No. <laughs> You've no idea how close to the truth that statement is. <laughs> it's so stupid already, but I love it. Also, what is this aspect ratio? It's like 16 by 9, but on a square screen, so everything's I, super corrupt. I remember I was hung. Put <laughs> yeah, I was death, hung alright, dick huge. Huh? In a laboratory? I'm an experiment. <laughs> of course. How fitting. This place thick with evil. This mad... Doctor. <laughs> it's so good. Okay. I have I we will not get far on this game because I'm bad at these games in general, and this is a game for adults. Like look at this bullshit. I have uncovered a new material, an undiscovered element, number 86 on this periodic table. I call it Lifestone. Oh, what a stupid fucking name. 
Okay. Pablo, hey, welcome up. What's up? What's going on? Yeah, we're playing. We're playing the bizarre like 1995 Frankenstein game starring Tim Curry the Doctor. It's very bizarre. What a strange looking table. I don't know if this is like a puzzle game or just an experience that you do. Unholy energies crackle from these diabolical contraptions. Surely they could not be of earthly origin. And there's a lot of yapping. There's a lot of yapping in this game. Do I know this man? He looks so familiar. Maybe he was me. <gasps> Black Death Basili has discovered London Tower Bridge. Judge Rothenbush blaming me for the disappearance of children from other villages? That lying coward. <laughs> I love the voices in this. How queer and quaint. Okay. I think I'm just going to explore and see what's, see what's around, but I don't think we're going to get very far. Oh my god. <gasps> Skelly Man Jones! I have created Curry. life, proving once again what I have always known to be true. Modesty be damned! I am a genius! <laughs> okay. I thought he was about to, like, whip himself. I thought he was about to, like, take off his clothes. Modesty be, modesty be damned! I'm a fine-looking man. <gasps> Skelly Man Jones! I can't click on Skelly Man Jones. <gasps> Bro, immediately problem solved. Puzzle solved. Great grated. How do, where do I go? <laughs> How do I turn? Um, you must help me. I appear to be stuck in here. Oh. oh, okay. I guess we're not going that way. I just hope, Philip, that you turn out better than the last experiment. Philip? The flesh grew so uncontrollably thick and twisted like pork butt. I'm sorry. You're confused. Huh? Actually, you look dazed, but dazed is good. It's still early for you, Philip. Okay, do you want to like go back? Do you want to go behind your little lectern again and start, I don't know, jorking each other? Oh, 3D rendered things. Let me click on them. Oh, go that way. Yeah, I don't know how. Uh, did I just pick up some rope? To hang myself. Perhaps hopefully. I should leave this here. Okay. Oh yes, that is the reason you and I are having this conversation, Philip. The sole reason is because of Energy L. Uh huh. Well, to be specific, Energy L and the Lifestone Crystal, of course. No. That sounded much Gently like a hint. Put it back on the shelf. Oh, nah. Obviously, there's more to this crystal than the doctor wants me to know. This this 3D I'll rendered it green again later, okay. when he is more deeply into his work. Okay. Oh god, I can't read this. Are you kidding me? This is like incredibly weird ass cursive font. Oh my god. Oh Jesus. This is gonna be. Okay, something something crystal is capable of producing spontaneous life. Unfortunately, the amount of voltage required to make the crystal glow is directly proportional to its size and density. The large crystal uh, I have has been able to use 15 centimeters long. Okay, 16 watts. Okay, 16 volts. Okay. Um, can I put this somewhere? Can I, like, take it with me? I do hope you find my research interesting. After all, you were also a scientist, no? Uh, oh no. Wait. I'm gonna ignore that. Oh no, it crashed. Oh. Guys, the 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 the, the, the Frank the Frankenstein game broke. Let's try it again. <laughs> what the fuck is going on? It broke. Why did it break? I thought this was going to work. I didn't realize it was going to break after exactly 15 minutes. <laughs> this is what I get for trying to play retro games. I like boot them up to make sure that they work and then I like <laughs> then it just crashes 15 minutes in. How do I skip this? How do I get through to the edge of game? I'm awake. Let me in. Hmm. Mm. Let me. Let me. He's alive. Let me in. Alive. Let me in. I. I have created life. I'm hitting all the buttons. Let me in. Fuck it. Let me in. Yeah. I don't care. This, that will make you feel. There's better. like no way to skip this. A toast. I'm. I'm spamming in all the buttons. Celebration. God damn it. I have made a man. What if we like, okay, what if we looked up a walkthrough uh, and try and get as far as we can before it crashes? How about that? 
Frankenstein, uh, 1995. I'm googling the shit. I'm googling the shit. Frankenstein, uh, what the fuck is this called again? This is like game walkthrough. Help me out here, buddy. Through the eyes of the monster, walk through King. Love that. Love that for me. The walkthrough is planned for a future date. Oh no, guys are screwed. <laughs> Uh, let me just like Firefox, come on, buddy. Where is it? If I like cropped it weirdly. Oh, there we go. Yeah, this is the website. This is the walkthrough guide for Frankenstein through the eyes of the monster. The walkthrough is planned for a future date. Please check back again for updates. This website was like last updated like five million years ago. I don't think they're gonna make it, guys. I don't think they're ever gonna release this walkthrough. The walkthrough king? You're a fake king. You're a fraud. Your crown is made of lies. Fuck you. God damn it. Every way I turn, it's just disaster and lies. Everyone lies to me. I want a walkthrough that isn't like a YouTube video because I want to be able to see it. Okay, apparently there's like different editions, okay. After viewing or at least listening to what happened to you. Um, okay. Okay. Let's see how far we can get before it causes it to crash. Okay, it didn't load the dialogue this time. That might be a problem. My hand. Okay. <laughs> Good God. It's the hand of a woman. I don't know what why he's so freaked out about having like lady hands. Done to me. I don't know, bro. Having a lady hand could be good. You, you can could wear stand like. Oh, sorry, the game isn't loading. Hang on. You're walking. There we go. You haven't missed anything. My bad. No residual dizziness. Excellent. Transitions fastest. That's fine. Anything? Let's go. Perhaps you can read lips. No, no. Perhaps you, you must can help me out with something else. Perhaps mm. the cat's got your tongue. You've no idea how close to the truth that statement is. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's quit. Quit sketching. I, I remember I was hung. Yeah, 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 yeah. Whatever. Okay, you get up and look around the lab. There's several things to see. For example, you click the blackboard. You put on a table. You could open a dumb waiter. Okay. This mad doctor. Okay. Take the life stone. Um, where's the life stone? Okay. Was the life stone the green thing? Hong? Yeah, bro, it was Hong. It was crazy. Wait, which one was the life stone again? The last one was the green thing, right? Oh, yes. That is the reason you and I are having this conversation, Philip. The sole reason is because of Energy L. Well, <laughs> Big L. To be specific, Energy L and the Lifestone Crystal, of course. Oh, so this now, isn't the Lifestone Crystal. Fuck you. Gently put it back on the shelf. Okay. I can't touch Energy L. Obviously, there's more to this crystal than the doctor wants me to know. <laughs> Women's hands such risk can be a convenient when getting arrested. Okay. He's more deeply into his work. What are you planning to do? kill more children like in this game just kidding but also unless what the fuck is the energy crystal where's the life crystal life crystal please oh that's the roof but let's not go to the roof bro what are we doing hello. i have a theory hello no it is more game theory energy moves it flows like waves mixing shaping affecting matter uh -huh. Visible light is a particular energy wave, as is sound, electricity, and heat. Ergo, life itself is also an energy wave, a specific vibration. It is that simple. The okay. mystery of life exposed. Okay, you're getting real close to me and talking about exposing yourself and letting down your, like, humbleness. Uh, I, 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 think I, need, I, think they, I think this is an escape room, but I'm escaping from him. Where the fuck is the life crystal? <laughs> I need the fucking life crystal. Where is it? Oh, but I've created you again. life 
proving once again what I have always known to be true. Modesty be damned! I am a genius! <laughs> Where the fuck is your life crystal, my guy? Life crystal! Hello? Cool. Okay. Okay, we gotta keep playing until it crashes. We gotta try and see how far we can get. Where the fuck is the life crystal? All of these like fake ass like jars of shit. Maybe it's maybe it is on here. Is it this? No. Oh cool, a rag. Let me put that back. What is the, What does the life crystal look like? It's like a fake thing. Hey Tim Curry. The servants have set up a room for you on the lower level. Please make yourself at home. A word of caution. Though you have had a serious concussion, to say the least, if you were to fall asleep, well, it would probably be <laughs> fatal. No. Of course, dying itself is not a problem, but the hemorrhaging, it could cause more damage to your brain. Okay, thank you, buddy. Thanks. I'm not going down there right now. I'm trying to solve this. As you see on this board, oh, God damn it, he's the energy again. spectrum contains a narrow band of energy, which is the essence of life. Energy L. It interacts with cells uh -huh. and tissue in ways I cannot yet explain, but you are evidence of its remarkable powers. Okay. Anyway, life crystal champ, life, life crystal king, life crystal. What does it look like? <laughs> At least tell me what it looks like. Uh, I would have thought the life crystal would be the fucking giant crystal. Is this not the life crystal? Oh wait, maybe I can... Can I move? Oh, okay. Oh! Oh, okay, here we go, here we go. Okay, put it on the table. Take the cloth and put it beside the lifestone, okay? Excellent. Okay, we're gonna jerk off with it? What? <laughs> this is the most convoluted shit ever, but th this is the kind of game that would take you like six months to beat back in 1995. And also it probably cost like a million dollars to make because it had Tim Curry in it. So they're, they're making the solutions very obscure. So you take four bits of rope. Like a parachute. <laughs> We're literally making a parachute for the green Kyber crystal. It's so, how esoteric is that? Take the four sets of rope, put them, yeah, okay. Now you have a parachute that you can throw through the window. Note, notice that it will go over the wall. Okay. So now we pick it up and go, wee, <laughs> goodbye, crystal, goodbye. This it's caught an updraft. It's going to go over the wall. How would you ever have figured this out without a walkthrough? You're mad. You would have to been tinkering with that shit all day. You will retrieve it later. Okay, God damn it. Okay, let's climb the ladder. It's not crashed yet, so I don't know what I did last time to make it crash. Look at the plat. Oh, it's pianich. Okay. Plan number two is associated with winds. Take careful note of the pattern because you will need it later on. You're shitting me. You gotta be like, oh, I must align the planets according to plaque plan number two. I'm taking a snapshot. Oh no, that's like an actual snapshot, not like a... Oops, ignore that. I didn't realize snapshot meant like like uh, console snapshot. Oops. <laughs> Oopsie. Uh, let me just take a snapshot of this uh, plaque that I will need later, apparently. Okay, yeah, okay, yeah, go down to the low level. Okay, we're good. Can I like explore the roof? I mean, I really love this like pre rendered graphic style. I really do love this. This is something that I could make, which is why I love it so much. Cause I'm like, I when I play games like this, I'm inspired by like, oh yeah, this is how they've done this. This is the aesthetic they've gone for. I love the mixture of like real photos and then CG. It's very weird, but like, like the ladder is obviously CG, the floor is CG, but then occasionally you'll just see like a real photo that they've like bashed in there. It's pretty fucking awesome. I love this. Anyway, can I go down the ladder please? Can I get out of here? <laughs> get out of here. Okay. Let's go find the trapdoor. Oh, God, not you again. I just hope, Philip, that you turn out better than the last experiment. The flesh grew so uncontrollably thick and twisted like pork butt. <laughs> okay. You look confused. Actually, you look dazed, but dazed is good. It's still early for you, Philip. Okay. Hey, Tim, how does that pork butt make you feel, by the way? Okay, thank you, Tim. Very good. Very good. Awesome. 
Okay, where's the fucking trap door? Let's go. Let's get out of here. Skedaddle. Yeah. <laughs> it is peak aesthetic. That is a scary ass noise. I'm gonna make the Tim Curry special kind of horny a sound alert. I think it's now my favorite sound of the world. It's my favorite sound of the world. Okay. Look at the large Tesla coil. Oh, hello. That looks like a vastly improved version of that Russian scientist Tesla's lightning coil. Wow. N fucking law dump, why don't you? It is already in the on position. You need to pull it down later on in the end game. You'll eventually find a note telling you about this information. Open the door beside this. <laughs> There's a lot of like, you'll do this later. I don't know why you're explaining this in the walkthrough, but whatever. Open the door beside the stairs. There are stairs in here? Oh, that. Oh. The challenge. Jeez, what a loud noise. The squeakiest of squeaky doors. We go towards the cannonballs. Okay. Start uploading YouTube videos while streaming? What? Since when? Yes, I'm making a walkthrough. I'm making a walkthrough for this game right now. The fuck is it? Where is it? Oh, cannibals. Where are they? Wall. Lovely wall texture. You're gonna love this wall. Watch the cannibals. You just got a notification from your last VOD? Really? That should have looked that should have uploaded at 5 p.m. What? <laughs> I try and upload them for 5 p.m. because then people are like, oh, I wonder if this person will stream soon, and then I do. Mm. <laughs> but yeah, I'm trying to get I'm trying to get the VODs back up. I'm trying to get up to speed with the VODs. I'm like a few I'm like a week behind, but I'll get there. Where the fuck are the cannonballs? Is that a cannonball? Is that a cannonball? I'm just gonna round I'm just gonna go around this round tower forever and ever. But yeah. I gotta remember to make more thumbnails. I gotta remember to make a, a thumbnail for this uh this uh, this crazy ass Frankenstein game and Eyes by Spooky Mansion. Where the fuck are the cannonballs? I'm going crazy here. Are they in this box? Oh yeah, okay. It's just like a YouTube delay. I get ya. Go towards the cannibals. Where the fuck are the cannibals? What the fuck is this? Why is it like a stone creature? What is that thing? Oh god, this looks like a puzzle and a half. Ah, the cannibals. Ah. Take one and put it in the seal basket. Okay. There we go. I did it. Pull on the rope. Oh, pull on my rope, says Tim Curry. Okay. Okay, King, whatever you want. God damn, it's so hard to like navigate in this. I feel like I'm like just rotating. Pull on the rope. The the rope. Pull on the rope. Oh, I see. Oh. Give it a give your rope your good old tug. Yeah. Nice. Very cool. What the fuck is this Rube Goldberg ass Frankenstein ass machine ass? And where does the life crystal come into this? What the fuck happened? Okay, what actually? Oh no, the moose fell off. I'm the moose string. I have to leave this here. The fuck does that mean? What do you mean you have to leave this here? Okay. Okay. Knocking the moose. Now pick the rope and turn right. Okay. How would you have known this? <laughs> All right, the moose has fallen off the wall. Good job. Now grab the rope, put it near the brick wall. Uh. <laughs> uh. Place it the wall. Now go through this opening and go down. Okay. Okay, cool. <laughs> Thank God the moose is here. Uh. You'll see the broken grade. Okay. Go through it. Okay, cool. We're going through the grate. Turn right. Okay, go down once. If oh. I steal the parts to do my own experiment, I could conduct it here away from the doctor uh -huh. and prove once and for all if energy L is real or if I'm dead. L is trapped real. forever in this hell. With it. Oh, apparently there's like a corpse in here. Hello. I was like, where's the corpse? I was like, oh. Sick. This room reeks of human waste. Nice delivery, bro. Now. 
Okay. Okay, turn left twice. Okay, down again. Okay, down. Okay. Get down, turn right. Okay. Cool. Oh my god, a puzzle. I can do. I can do things. <gasps> oh no, my key. Oh my cogs. No, my cogs. My precious cogs. Dink donk. Oh god, they, they fell so slowly. Okay. Can I stop the pulley? Is it gonna keep going? Okay, great. Okay, put them back in place. Okay. I think I can do cog puzzles. I'm smart, I think. Uh, No, it doesn't fucking work. Damn it. What about this one? Hmm. What about, when I put this one, what about this one? Hmm. Uh, no, that sucks. No, that's, that, that's wrong. <laughs> no, it's wrong. Uh, okay, what about this one? No, it doesn't fit. What about, what about this one? And maybe this one? And then maybe this one? No. <laughs> um, no. What about this one? You know when I said I was good at cog puzzles? I lied. Oh, I did it. Yippee. I'm so smart and clever. I really am just gonna like, I wonder how long this is. This, this game is really long. We probably won't get very far with it. <laughs> Especially when this is the speed at which the door opens. Are you kidding me? But we can save and come back to it. So like, maybe we can put, maybe we can try and complete this. Uh, I mean, do we want to complete this? I feel like it's so esoteric. Even with the walkthrough in front of me, I'm like, I would have never guessed this stuff like in a million years. So I don't know if we want to beat this game. I think I might, I think I might pick a different game for next time, but we'll just see how far we can get. See if it gets any interesting. This is one of those games where you really just have to click around forever until you figure it out. It's not like a puzzle game. It's more just like a, like a brute force game. Cause this walkthrough is long as well. Okay. Okay. Yada yada yada. Point and click adventure. It can't, yeah, well, I mean, I kind of prefer a point and click adventure, which is a bit more like point and clicking and adventuring. This is just like, you're going to be staring at a brick texture. You have to click the right brick. <laughs> that sort of level. Okay. Okay. Da, 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 da. Now I go through. You know? Ah, the great hall, I think, of some description. Okay. Okay, go to the double doors, let's go. I mean, I really love this like type of game where it's like you've pre-rendered every, every like view you want, you just pre-render it. It has a certain charm to it. Mm. Okay. Leftovers, I'm starving. I shall eat, but I wouldn't eat those, buddy. Go towards the fireplace and take the bag, okay. Okay. Where's the fireplace? Got this, so. So hard to Oh, hello. Oh my god. My boy. Who the fuck entered? Hello. Hello, Mr. Man in a trench coat. Dead tissue. Uh-huh. The meal was quite good. Too bad you missed it. Eat what's left. Damn, bro. You're a fucking freak. Eat my fucking toes, you... Monster. Mmm, yummy. Dead tissue. Of just, course. Just like my you. guy have no way to carry it. Just fucking eat it, you dick. I have no way to... I cannot possibly carry this chicken leg. Oh, where is me? Man, get the fuck out of here. All right. Tim. What do you want, Tim? Click all the bricks. Okay, I guess he fucked off. Great. So this is technically my inventory. Yes, this will certainly come in handy. You don't even know what's fucking in it, you creep. Okay. Click on the bag to see its contents. Okay. Oh, okay. It's a it's an illegible note. My favorite type of illegible note. I am haunted at being unable to find an anti bacterial thread. This black line infection is to a problem. Is, oh, it's proving to be a greater problem than bringing back the dead. 
man, I can read cursive, but this is bullshit. <laughs> I have bleh, several large pieces of the black infection, which, oddly enough, uh, seems to grow through the tissue like a fuzzy spaghetti. Mmm, fuzzy spaghetti. Uh, it almost, bleh, almost acts like a parasitic worm, although I am sure it is a bacterium of some kind. Okay, great, cool. Anyway, <laughs> anyway. Okay, exiting to the left of the fireplace. Okay. Okay. We did that. Exit to the way, so okay. Go right. And then left. Okay, go right on the left and then enter the door on the right. Okay. Again, this is just like, you would get so lost in this. Oh, cool. Legs. Mm, yummy. Guys, I need to eat food at some point. I did not eat before stream. This is a very unusual thing for me to do. Uh, but I didn't eat before stream, so I might have to like... I'll try and end the four hour mark when I go eat. I fucking sneeze. Oh god, I sneeze so hard like my whole body like f tensed up. Oh god. I'm dying. I'm Dr. I'm Dr. Fran Frankenstein dying. Hang on, let me go close a window. It's fucking freezing in here. Yeah, sorry. Like, but stre getting streaming is difficult because it's so difficult to get your room to be the right temperature. Because, uh, like, if you if, if you just close all the windows and turn every like turn the fan off, they get the like the room gets so hot with the temperature of like streaming PCs. But if you open a window after a while, the room gets so fucking cold because it's like winter now, or, like autumn. I need to like <laughs> balance that a bit better. Hey, what the fuck do we do in the meat room? in some kind of kitchen. Okay. Read the note again. Okay. Is there a note here? <laughs> oh no, I've got a fucking call now. It was some kitchen. Found read the note found there. There's a there's a note in here? There's a note in the kitchen? Oh of course we can turn around. There's a fish in the kitchen. <laughs> okay, ni nice like rustling the door. Oh, SFX. Oh, here's the note. Dear Victor, thank you for your hospitality and the delicious meal. As usual, I had a wonderful time. I enjoy eating Perrier's cooking almost as much as I love seeing your newest discoveries. Thank you for allowing me to use your library for my own research. I appreciate it very much. You are very kind, Victor. Sincerely, Sarah Strauss. Okay. Can I pick this up? No. Okay. Okay. No other doors open on this floor except for the ones leading outside. Okay, so we gotta fuck out of here. Can we even fuck out of here? Okay, get me out of here. I need to go up some staircases. I don't know where the staircases could be though. This is a cryptic ass. This is locked. This game is just like endless identical hallways. Where are the hallways? Oh, I got the moon room with this fucking dapper gent. And a suit of armor with a keyhole. God, this is gonna be such a cryptic. Oh, can I get up these stairways? Okay, there we go. I mean, it's pretty cool the amount of like views that they rendered for this. I am so lost though. I'm so lost. I'm so lost. I'm sure this pyramid brick is important at some point. God damn it. I am already lost. <laughs> Even with the guide, it's just like, just go up the stairs forehead. I'm like, okay. Climb up one of the two stairways in the main hall. Only one door opens towards a burnt, only one door opens towards a burnt room. Okay, what if I try the other staircase? Oh god, it's so, like, difficult to know 
which direction you're facing, I guess. Just because... <laughs> just because, uh... There's, like, no, like... There's no point of reference. Like, I don't know which direction I'm facing when I go through doors. It's a problem. It's like, where am I facing? I guess I'm facing forwards, but so I can walk forwards and, like, walk left, maybe? Maybe walk into this room? The fuck is this? Let's go up the stairs. Uh, I'm so lost. I'm literally so lost. What the fuck? Die, it is locked. Locked. Fuck me. Fuck me sideways with a Frankensteinian fork. Locked. Oh god. Oh jeez. Okay. This walkthrough is so unhelpful. It's like, go through any of the staircases, only one door will open to a burn room. Uh-huh. Which one, bestie? This, which one, my dear? Could you tell me? <gasps> Wobbleface! Hi, Wobbleface. How are you doing? Happy Thursday. I love Wobbleface. Hello, hello. I give you big hearts. How are you doing? I am struggling with this. <laughs> Locked. I'm struggling with creepy R. Maybe this was not the right room at all. <gasps> Wait, is it this one? Is it this one? No, can't go in there. This is this is not so. Maybe I should have done the video walkthrough. <laughs> this is the main hall, right? Right? This looks like a main sort of hall. Maybe it's not the main hall. Oh. Oh, beautiful outside. Beautiful, beautiful renders of trees. Aww. If I really am alive, and this isn't the afterlife, then maybe I could clear my name. Okay. Just having that thought. I could probably get into that room by climbing out onto that limb. Through to that window. Oh. Yippee. Post haste, my friend. But if I were stitched together and brought back from the dead, am I truly alive? Been looking eating noodles, that's that's epic. That's tray epic. That's what are we so fucking cool. I wanna eat some noodles. I wanna eat some noodles real bad. I appreciate the luck as well. Oh goodness, I am so lost in this uh, this cursed manner. Oh hello. What the heck? Oh, that's the fucking okay, here we go. So this is the main room, okay. I need to go up some stairs. And find a buoyant room. I might give up on this game, I'll be honest. It's like, even following the walkthrough, it feels really unrewarding. Because I'm like, well, I'm just following the walkthrough and cheating. But at the same time, how would I ever have guessed? <laughs> locked. Everything is locked. Apparently there is... It's so, yeah. They, I, as much as I love point and click games, they're so disorienting sometimes. I'm like, which, which way am I facing? I end up walking right back to where I start because I don't understand. Is there something to post to me? Oh, yippee. I'll like open the envelope and they'll just like flop, flop onto the floor and eat them off the ground. Eat them off the ground like a like a rabid dog. Oh, okay. So those stairs mean you're going to the stairs. I see. You know, it makes sense. Okay. <laughs> okay. Now, where the heck is this burn room that I'm looking for? This, like, these, like, identical... These identical, uh, like, doors are not helping me. These identical, like, walls and doors. That's the locked one. Locked. Okay. I just wanna, I just wanna get somewhere. One, is one of these doors a burn room? I swear, like, none of these are continuous, either. I swear, like... I swear, like, these... These are non-Euclidean stairs. I swear to God. Locked. Locked. Okay. I want Tim Curry back. I miss Tim Curry. I miss my bestie. I miss my Franken-bestie. This is... Yeah, this is definitely a game that would, like, take many, many years to beat. <laughs> So that's the stairwell. Can you go left? No, there's brick wall. Can you go this way? I swear I've explored all the rooms up here. Locked! Okay. That's the stairwell out. So is it like... No? 
in this way. That's a wall, bestie. That's the stairwell again. How the fuck did I miss that? <laughs> How the fuck? Like Scoob, I'm going insane. I swear to God, this game is taunting me. I genuinely don't know which of these doors are, are like stair doors and not stair doors. I need a fucking map, but I'm guessing they don't have one. They're like, make your own damn map, bestie. Yeah, okay. So that's a stair door. So we head like right and then down and then across and then that's another locked door. Okay. Oh God, I just get turned around. I just get turned around. That's a stair door. No, that's no, this is the upstairs door. Have we been this way? What the fuck? Oh no, then this, is, then this leads to this weird ass corridor. Okay. Okay, okay. <laughs> Let, this is, okay, this is why, okay, I'm gonna fucking call it here, but this is why this game is insane. Okay, here is, here is a frame of a door on the left hand side and a candle burning. Commit this, commit this into your memory. All right? Now let me turn left. It's the, it's the fucking same. It's the same. It's just a doorway on the left and a torch. How I would just get these two confused at first glance. <laughs> I don't know which direction I'm facing. I need a compass. I need a compass and a map and ideally some sat nav and GPS. This is mad. This is utterly maddening. Man, how do people play games in the 90s? I love the aesthetic, but the act of actually playing these games drives me insane. I have not, I've yet to find the burn room. I have yet to find the way out. I have been driven insane. I'm just rattling doors. Maybe the, uh, maybe the walkthrough was wrong. I, yeah, I'm, yeah, I, I. Locked. Locked, cool, cool bestie, cool. Cool, locked door, awesome. Awesome, I love that for you bestie, love the locked doors. Love that. And this is the no. That's not the, I don't know. I gotta go find some shovelware that's a bit easier to do. This is just the upstairs again. Or I should be writing a map down, but like that's a lot of effort for a game I'm only gonna play for like a few hours. Locked, yeah. Genuinely, I I thought I thought I could make it somewhat far with a walkthrough because it's a walkthrough. But now I'm just like. No, I got no fucking clue because the walkthrough just says to walk up either of these flights of stairs and then go into a burnt room. But I'm like, I have tried all the doors and they're all locked. Or their stairs. Ah, the oh, we found the burnt room. Jesus Christ. <laughs> I found the burnt room, guys. I just had to complain enough. Okay, cool. Take the fucking screenshot, besties. Take a fucking sip. I think if I try to play this game legitimately, I would go insane, given that I've already gone insane so far. Playing it for 36 minutes has already driven me insane. So, mm. Also, there isn't enough. The ratio of frustrating door puzzles and Tim Curry is not a good ratio. If it was like a 50-50 ratio between annoying door puzzles and Tim Curry, I'd be like, okay, for you, Tim, for you, bestie, maybe but the ratio is more like 595. <laughs> I kind of, I'm, oh God, someone just got toasted. Someone got roasty toasted here. I've got to find more point and click games that are not that are a little less esoteric. I think they all are to an extent though. There's no way to avoid it. If you have a point and click game, if, if it was easy to know what to do, you'd be able to beat it in 15 minutes, which, would make the game not a good value for money. So they add value to money for these games by making them impossible. <laughs> make them impossible, why not? Okay. Be careful to write down this exact position. Have you played Fran Bo? I have not played Fran Bo. Is it good? Is it is it a spooky style game? Cause I'm looking for spooky games. Frambo. Oh, Frambo is that game. Yeah, I know the one. But that's like a modern point and click, so it's a bit more... You love the story? Interesting. I mean, it's kind of like a... Is it a... It's kind of a spooky game, right? Okay, I'll add, fr add Friend Bow to a list of games we might play. 
Um, because I'm always looking for more games to play over spooky times. I'll write that to the list. The Franbo. Okay, it's a little spooky. I like a little spooky. Oh god, I'm just reading through the walkthrough and it's like... You will find stairs going up to the third floor. It's just like, the, the walkthrough is written like, you will find... You will find, you will find this. And I'm like, I will not find this, bestie. I will get lost and cry. <laughs> I will not find this. Imagine if like the walkthrough to any game was like, ah, oh, you'll just figure it out. <laughs> yeah, bestie, you'll just figure it out. Mm-hmm, sure. So it's turn right, forwards. Turn right, forwards. Right, well that's a wall, so clearly not. <laughs> Where was the upstairs again? Was it this one? Oh, it is this one. Nice. Okay, we got it right. This is the observatory. What is it? Okay. Wait, so okay, hang on. Turn right. Oh, okay. Turn right. Forwards. Right. Wait, hang on. Forwards. Right. Wait, what? Huh? Wait, what? Huh? I'm already lost. I'm already lost. Help. Everything is a dead end. Locked. Everything is locked. Everything is cocked locked. This is the third floor. This is absolutely the third floor. We're on the third floor, bestie. Yeah, okay. Turn right. Okay. Go forwards. Turn right. Forwards. Right is fucking the wall, so I think I've gone up the wrong staircase. Oh, maybe, oh no, this is it. Okay. I think the walkthrough was just wrong then. <laughs> Dear Dr. Frankenstein. Dear pesky plumbers. I'm writing to you with the strictest confidence. The Koopalings and I, I agree with you that Judge Rothen, Judge Redbush is a vile and despicable man. Unfortunately, he's really sexy, so we can't do anything about it. We cannot afford to lose his favor and influence. It is already a tense situation and our hands are bound. Do nothing to incur his wrath. The judge is an old man and we can wait him out. We both have much to lose. Oh, we both have too much to lose. Please destroy this letter upon receiving it. As always, I am at your service, Vladimir. Vladimir Putin? Russia is involved. I knew it. The Russian state wants to get me to be a creature. I understand. November 30th, 1879. I delivered the goods to your puppet researcher. If only he knew the truth. Please keep me please keep me in your mind for any future deliveries. Yours truly, Vladimir. P.S. I'm thinking of invading Crimea. I hope that's alright with you. That little shit I knew is up to new good. I don't know why I gave him a Cockney accent. It just made sense. Okay. Of course the Russians are involved with Frankenstein, yeah. Nothing can be done yet in this room. I like how they're just like, this walkthrough is like, go in the room, read the shit. You can't do anything, leave the room. Ah, uh, why did you make me get here, bestie? What if I want to look at the, whatever this is. What if I want to look at the, the inside of a telescope that's pointing squarely at nothing, like the brick wall? What even is pointing at, is this like the cap still on? What's going on? I want to make a point and click game that like uses this aesthetic, but also isn't like a fucking obnoxious to play. <laughs> I want to make a point and click game where it's like, but you have a map though, but you have a mini map. So you don't get horribly lost or at least make it more rewarding. I need more Tim Curry right now. I need Tim Curry to whisper sweet nothings into my ear. I want him to tell me what the smoke and fumes make him feel. Ideally in a sexual manner, please. Hmm. Okay. Uh, where was I? Go back down to the Great Hall. Oh, great. They just walked through and made me go all the way through this maze and be like, actually, you didn't need to come here. Tee hee. There wasn't even a plaque I had to memorize slash take a screenshot of. <laughs> How do people play this game before screenshots? Cause like, 
I'm taking screenshots of those plaques, but is this game gonna really make me like write down planetary alignments? That's a bit more difficult than a letter password, you know? Tim Curry, please, please expose yourself. Show me your modesty and your and your hog, please. Locked. Oh wait, this isn't locked. I lied. Unlocked. <laughs> There's actually no lock at all. All right, what the fuck? Nothing. Can, I love this walkthrough. There's like nothing can be done here. Go away. And I'm like, why? Why did you make me walk up these stairs then? My poor legs. Go outside and turn left. Bestie, I've never been more happy to leave the room. <laughs> Oh, I love the sound of crunched, like, bird audio. It's great. Go left towards the tower near the courtyard doors. Uh-huh. Okay, the red dragonfly will become handy later. Can I grab it, though? I guess I just... <laughs> hmm. Maybe if I had some way to secure the rope to the tree. Hmm. I like how he just picked it up loosely, then he was like, What's the point? I'll never attach it to the tree. Oh. Oh, screenshot time. Oh, screenshot time. Let me just take a screenshot of that real quick. To please my daddy, Tim. I'll just be like, Hey, I collected all of your plaques. Let's go make out. And he'll be like, Oh, the poison. Mm. All right. You'll be able to climb the wall. Oh, hang on. Okay. Look at the plaque on the tree. This is plaque number four. And it's associated with height. Take note of the path. Go up towards the town of the courtyard odds. Okay. Can I climb the wall? It's so difficult to, like, actually aim. <laughs> Can I turn right? No, turn right, and then... Huh? Okay. Go left towards the tower near the courtyard doors. Is it this courtyard doors or these courtyard doors? Maybe it's not here. <gasps> the well! The well of, 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 of green. Can I climb this wall? Can I... Can I climb this wall? <laughs> God, that, that wall texture is really stretched. <laughs> That's kind of funny. They're just like, uh, do we, do we have any, like, do we have any way of tiling this texture? No. Uh, just stretch it, buddy. No one's gonna, no one's gonna notice. No one's gonna notice that this wall texture is really stretched. Why didn't you tile it? These textures clearly tile because that's how you make any wall in a game. You just have a tileable wall texture. Why did you stretch it, bestie? That's not okay. That's not okay, bestie. You've, you've fucked that up. You've, you've royally, oh, God. How do people look at this for like several hours and be like, hmm, deep in thought. Lovely wall texture, lovely. Sorry, UV machine broke, yeah. Sorry, they haven't quite figured, they've like figured out how to tile it, just not really, like, not like, yeah. Just not sensibly. What's really funny is that with pre-rendered games like this, they still did the like beautiful lighting. Like the bit, like obviously because it's just a, uh, just a, like a baked image. They went so hard on the lighting, like in certain scenes here, like, the, like look at like look at that lighting on that on that floor like that's really nice probably took like a week to render on an IBM <laughs> but yeah when it actually but then when you then you look at the next wall and you're like Ugh. like ooh. Ugh. <laughs> it's like it's such a mixture of really like high fidelity and really not high fidelity god this is confusing go towards go left towards the tower near the courtyard doors but from what perspective? You'll be able to climb the wall. Okay. Which wall, bestie? The one that looks like that? Or are we thinking the one that looks like this? And he just needs to get... God, if I got a fucking call from this, I'm so mad. Actually, to be honest, I've just been at like a work conference, so I probably got a call from them. God damn it. Why are people so full of disease when you put them in a room together? Modern, modern, like, yeah, meeting people for work is the worst. It's not a, it's a losing proposition because you inevitably get sick. <laughs> yeah, I don't know fucking which wall I'm supposed to be climbing here. <laughs> I don't know which wall I'm supposed to be climbing. It says turn left. I tried to turn left. It did not let me. 
Oh, here we go. <gasps> Gambling! Why is it like daylight when I look up and then sunset when I look down? That's very bizarre. Yeah, get your gamblings out of the way. Okay. To the left was the courtyard wall. It's like it won't let me walk up to the edge of the wall. It just like teleports me around. Go left towards the tower near the courtyard doors. Oh, it means that tower, I bet. Okay, it means that tower. Okay, okay. Now that I know that it means that tower, so I should be able to climb- That lifestone crystal ah. is at the top of this tower. There must be a way to the top. Just climb it, bestie. Just click on the rip. Just click on the rocks, bestie. Just click on the rocks. It's too easy, bestie. Just click on the rocks. Just keep clicking on the rocks, bestie. Just, just, yeah. Put that in your bag. This uh. could be useful later. Oh, good to you. Okay, well, we just collected the crystal. <laughs> Yippee! I love climbing walls and climbing down the walls. Okay, I think I'm going to call it here because I'm like A, sick, B, need to eat food, and C, we're like at four hours. So I'm going to like save here, file, save game. Oh my god, you actually get to save as like a little file? Wow, look at that. I'm going to save it. I'm going to save this as save one. Saved as an STA, which stands for a spooky type of animation. Okay. Can I, like, load the game then? Is there, like, an option to load the game? File. Open game. Oh, okay, cool. Well, then let's just leave then. Let's just, like, get out of here. How do I quit? There we go. Okay, maybe we'll continue this next time. Oh, yeah, also board jump scare. <laughs> um, maybe we'll continue this next time, or I'll find something better to play, because, frankly, uh, I'm <laughs> there was no way I could have played this without a walkthrough. It's so bizarre. Uh, but, yes, thank you so much for stopping by. I really appreciate you all for stopping by on our shovelware Thursdays, our, uh, like, throwback Thursdays. Um, yeah, I'm going to go look for... Um, someone to raid. Let's have one final, uh, Tim Curry saying the word horny for the road. Thank you, Tim. Uh, and let's look, so, let's look for someone to raid. Bye-bye. Thank you so much, Holden, and Lifex, and Blurbs, and Robot Face, and Axon. He is asleep. And Mako as well, or Mako. Thank you so much for stopping by. Who's live? Can we raid Cass? Because Cass is still on. Um, oh, okay. Cass is going to end. Cass is going to end because uh, she's probably going to like finish soon as well. In which case, let's raid. <laughs> let's raid Jules because Jules popped by earlier. And Jules always stops by. And we love Jules. Let's go with Jules. Show Jules some love. Uh, just do like a regular old. Um, You could do a Tim Curry raid. Or Tim Curry Stein raid. Do a Tim Curry Stein raid. There's like no emoji, it's just that. Tim Curry Stein raid is the, is the raid message. Um, yeah, awesome. Yeah, okay, so I will see you guys on set. Unless I'm like too ill. I don't think I'm going to be too ill. I think this is just a cold, but I'll let you guys know in the Discord and on Twitter and or Blue Sky. Um, once again, go follow me on Blue Sky, because... Uh, I wasn't here with Tim Curry in the Frankenstein game. Yeah, he was like Dr. Frankenstein, kind of. I don't know what the plot is. It's like some sort of weird bastardization of Frankenstein. Um, he, yeah, he's he's just kind of being creepy and being like, oh, yes, I've created life. So I assume he's Dr. Frankenstein, but yeah. Hopefully we'll get to see more of him if we do com continue this game. But uh, yeah. Yeah, ooh, Twitter. Yeah, that's why we're using Blue Sky now. He was and he was horny. That's true. He's, uh, he's a special kind of horny. Say that again, Tim. Say that again, just for me, buddy. Thank you, Tim. Thank you very much. Love you. I kiss him on the lips. Okay. Go show Raid some love. There's a Raid message again if you need it. Tim Curry Stein Raid. Get it, get it, get it. We're going to Raid in seven seconds, so I'll see you on Saturday for more Silent Hill 1. Have a great rest of your week. Goodbye.